Tell Chad about um, my girl dinner tonight. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, and pickles. No, 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 no. I have more than just pickles. Uh, and was it, was this? Uh, yes, and then Dr. Pepper and so does it. That's <laughs> Girl dinner. Girl di what was your girl dinner tonight, Chad? Or did you have like a real dinner? <laughs> Dave plus you when? I don't know. I always joke about how eventually I want to be big enough as a streamer to make a plushie of myself. But like, I feel like if we got a plushie of Dave, that would be equally puntable. <laughs> Thank you for the- See? See? I remember to turn my tits on. They're- They're on. Okay? <laughs> what? If you haven't eaten yet, and it's time for you, please eat. No! Kill yourself! Make bad choices! Oh, no. I shouldn't I was trying to go for like a foil thing, like a good cop, bad cop, and then I just went like. I, I meant not. I meant kill yourself as in like don't take care of your body, stop, not like. Stop saying kill yourself. Just, just don't use. I'm those sorry. Words. I'm sorry. Did you just slap your booze when celebrating turning your tits on? Yes. No, it was my nuts. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. But welcome in everybody. So I was asking Dave as we were sitting here uh, before stream. And I was wondering, I was like, hey, Dave, what, what happened? So, Dave, would you like to give our, our last session recap? Uh, so, uh, we talked to Nobark. Yes. Um, went to the Repcon facility. Hmm. Fallout New Vegas being the perfect game that it is. Hmm. Ate shit and crashed. Yay! Uh, so, we made it through, like, halfway through the first floor, and <laughs> then it crashed, and we're back at the beginning. Yay! Um, we also face-checked several land. Oh, yeah! I remember I got I got cucked. Also, Sonalia, thank you so much for the, the six months. You have six PlayStations. And also, uh, Entanglement, congratulations on being a stream VIP. Thank you, gamers. Uh, you gotta stay in a game afterwards. It's made out. Oh, shit. Uh, uh, in Minecraft. In Minecraft. There we go. We're good. We're good. We're good. Uh, I'm having trouble hearing David. Let me move my yeah, mic over. Because here's the thing is if I, if David comes like too close to me, my VTube studio isn't going to know which face to follow. <laughs> We're going to have like a Frankenstein type situation. Let me just like move her over here. Is that better? Dave, speak. No, Talk, uh, Valentina. <laughs> Ella. Ella. <laughs> okay. So uh, we're uh, gonna hmm? let us know if you can't hear me, and I will either mm. yell louder or we'll like so. Yes. Also, I'm glad you like my new haircut. It's cool because like I kind of showed this off um when I first came back, but then it broke. So I can like put my hat back on. I can like take my glasses off. I can like whoop 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 whoop, and then I can also be bald. But I don't remember the hotkey for that you know weird. he's still kind of sound the same um i guess we'll just die oh the music's a bit loud i always have my bgm too loud i need to oh that's what it was i turned my gain down because i was singing and when i sing i like to so i don't want to give too much tea um like some ram ranch bro bro 18 naked cowboys in the sh that's how i sing actually in real life i have a classical music degree and i got up on stage for my my senior year jury and they're like what will you be singing for us today miss eb games and i was like well i'm gonna sing um something from one of the greats Yanis started playing and i went 18 naked cowboys in the sh i'm sorry <laughs> but welcome it let me turn the bgm off and let me actually let's actually get the show on the road okay but i was gonna say something else to chat but i don't i don't remember what i was gonna say oh yeah but i am recording a new cover soon and um i don't want to give spoilers for it um but to give you like an idea of the vibe of the cover um it, i wasn't sure what the song was about because i was trying to translate it from japanese um and at first i was like i think this might be about sex and then david read the english translation and was like this is about an abusive relationship. And I was like, oh, but like, it's a banger though. So, oh, it's real. You fucked know, up. it's really fucked up, but I sound really cool. So if you're subscribed, if you're subscribed, you'll be able to hear the preview of it. It's going to be really fucked up and the, and the song's really sad, but that, oh shit. But there will be uh, art of me and cat ears. So there's that. Oh, hello. You also get jet mirror. 
We also get Jetmere pictures. Yes, yeah, subscribe to EB Games today for Jetmere pics and um, song cover previews. <laughs> like the Polish song about depression. It's not Polish. I don't know. I kind of want to start singing in other languages. Like right now, I can sing in English, Japanese, Spanish, um, German, French, and Italian. Those are the languages I feel comfortable with. But I kind of want to learn how to sing in Korean, and I kind of want to learn how to sing in Indonesian. And I also want to cover that song in Eurovision, the, the Cha 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 song. I want to cover that one. Um, but I think that's in like, I don't, I don't know what language that's in. I think it's in Finnish, so that might be the first step to think, figuring that out. I think cover the Eiffel. 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 No, that it was in, a look up. Um, look up. In uh, Eurovision, look up Cha 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 Eurovision. It's like one of the catchiest fucking songs, bro. It was, it was good. Oh wait, I know why. I know why David's hard to hear. Hold on, it's because I have a noise gate on. Oh my god. Turn that shit off. Yeah, get that fucker out of here. <laughs> there he is. The people must there hear he me. is. Evie should do some Mongolian throat singing, bro. There's so many like vocal things where it's like I want to wish like. I, I talked to some of my uh, my voice students about this a lot. For those who don't know, uh, I'm a singing teacher. And my, like, training in... Uh, oh, excuse me, sir. Can you... There's, like, no bullet sounds. You're There's, out like... Of ammo. Oh, I was like... <laughs> I was like, why is there no bullet sounds? There's music. Why is there... <laughs> okay, let's try this one. Yeah, there's still no bullet sounds, which is weird. Um, we had, like, audio for talking, but now we just have... <laughs> I mean, check your settings first. Now we have no bullet sound, I, I, which is, I like... I don't think we I feel like I feel like there's just, like, no... We can't have a good Fallout stream. It's just not right, gonna here, happen. I'll, I'll, I'll make the gun noises from Do you want to make the gun noises? Yeah, yeah. Because just... I checked the dialogue, because when I went downstairs... Here, actually, we'll, we'll do a check. We'll, like, go... Because I heard guy talking and it, it, it was like a full-on like interaction thing you know so i was like okay so it's like we can either hear people speak or we can have gun noises but oh, i'm kind of no. here for david making the you, gun noises you huh can't it just works this game this was not, not a todd howard game so what's the excuse then uh it's, it's cool. small indie team uh, <laughs> no small this, indie game this is company. not a todd howard game though that's the thing is people are like oh pew 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 <laughs> yes. I'm afraid to mod Fallout New Vegas with, like, all the issues we had. Like, I'm going to break it. Okay, let me see if we can hear him. No, it was working. Okay, I think I know what I have to do, actually. I think I have to, like, do something like this. That's right. It's on the, the wrong thing, I think. God, I can't have a single. You really just can't have shit in Baltimore. You know, you just really can't. We're in Nevada now, though. We're in Nevada now. Okay, yeah. let me try resetting this and seeing if that <laughs> works. A Fallout stream without scuff in this economy? I think not. Uh, we might restart the game. Worst case scenario. Um, you can help me get good at singing? Yeah, I can actually. Yeah, it was working literally. It's so weird because it's like I start stream. I swear to God, I check these things and I start stream. And it's like... Fuck you, because you can hear like noise, right? Yeah, you might need to restart the game for it to We're gonna to restart work. I, I the would... game real quick. Okay. We'll do that real quick, but and then I can catch up on reading chat. But uh, yeah, I make I make the people sing good. <laughs> uh, there are time bog fi uh, bug fixes. I said bog fixes. We're fixing the yeah, bog. We probably <laughs> should get the unofficial. Pet, we probably should. Honestly, we have been least. just raw dogging it this entire time, but well, that's okay. Welcome in, gamers. Like I totally support. The idea of playing it Sorry. Vanilla the first time, mm -hmm. but, but a few quality of life things. Well, might be that's how I was with RimWorld. I refuse to download any RimWorld mods. Okay, like there's sound, there's like the the music. It's loud as hell, but like it's there, you know. Okay, oh, found, let me in. Boundary, if you made too much, you can share. Yeah, did you bring enough food for the rest of the class? David made me macaroni and cheese, and it was so hard. Okay, let me see. Oh, there's gun noises. I don't know. I kind of like David making the gun noises. Can you keep going pew pew when I shoot gun? Uh, maybe. Uh, I it, love that. I okay. Know, I still. I, it, it makes me think okay, I just had to restart it, and we're good. <laughs> makes me think of the Payday Two April Fools thing. What was the Payday Two April Fools? Oh, uh, there, there was an April Fools Day where they replaced a lot of the gun noises with like, gu just like sounds people made like verbally. So like one of the mm -hmm. shotguns was just someone screaming. Bro, wait, I got that autism. We could just make my vocal skins like gun noises. Can you imagine like, like shooting a like grenade launcher and it's just me going for like three seconds? Holy shit. There was one of them that was just someone going, whoopah! Whoopah! <laughs> Uh, well, and, welcome and, and in the, gamers. The noise the cloakers made was just someone going, tra la 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 la. Tra la 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 la. 
What's in here? Is there more toilet water? Oh shit, it's just files. What's in the filing cabinets? Uh, bullets. Oh, and cigarettes, yummy. What the fuck is going on in this office? What do you mean? And a cup. <laughs> and a cup, just one. David, do you, do you, you know what this reminds me of, David? What does this remind This of? reminds me of, um, <laughs> the safe deposit boxes in Payday 2. No, we're not going back. <laughs> David, would you like to tell the people what I do? Um, with the okay. safe deposit boxes in Payday 2. She insists on opening every single I don't want to miss anything. It, who cares? It turns what should be a 15 minute match <laughs> into an hour and a half. I don't want to miss anything. You, I hope you realize that you we spend so much time on it that could be spent doing literally anything else that would make but more money. But you want to make sure you don't. You, you that, don't. that was the one you already checked. No, but I wanted the cigarettes. Oh my God. Rune said cigarettes were valuable. Well, cigarettes are worth something. I love cigarettes. Are you going I to check the it's... other ones? Oh, wait, there's more? There are two other filing cabinets well, in that Well, let me room. open this door, and then I'll figure this shit out. Oh, thank you for the alert, gamer. I appreciate it. Welcome in, please. I appreciate it. Literally, okay, by the way, my uh, this goes out to anyone, like, whether you're new to my stream, whether you're old to my stream, whatever the fuck. Let me hydrate real quick. If you have a funky name on Twitch, and you tell me, like, oh, this is how you pronounce it, I love you. I will literally, like, give you my firstborn, because the amount of times I, like, am illiterate, too fucking much. Too fucking much. Mm. Isn't the money for like pre-war money? Doesn't that money not mean anything? Uh, it actually sells for a decent amount. Oh, fuck on some ghoul bitch in Fallout Three Two. Oh hell yeah, she ghoul on my nuts to like New Vegas. <laughs> What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> well, welcome in everybody. Hello. We just What's got that? started. There's huh? bullets on top of the uh, on top of the safe too. Oh, I thought that was like. I thought that was like a box of condoms. I'm gonna be real with Why you. Why would there be a box of condoms on top of the safe? Are you implying people can't have sex in the apocalypse? What I'm implying is that if you're in the mood, you're not going. Hold on, let me open my safe to retrieve my condoms. Um. You don't know these people. You don't know their story. Also, you're in an office building. Yeah, people fucking offices all the. Ah, get back up! Who the? Who? Who's man's? Can you? Someone's like vomiting. Can you? There's, there's a guy, I hear him. And it was like, I thought he was super close. I think my game is just like really loud. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> so did you know that you have a compass that shows you where enemies near you are? I was, that's the guy, that's the one. He's the one who's fucking. I don't think, that. I, I think his dick fell off. Well, he's never gonna fuck again cause I capped his ass, I, but like. I don't think he has a dick. Do you wanna check? Don't check. <laughs> Thank you, David. What's this? Ooh. It, it's an empty whiskey bottle. Okay. Oh, I thought I could, like, drag it, like, in Skyrim. You can. I think it's Z. Ooh, syringes. Yay. Okay. <laughs> He's right. Probably ghouls don't have noses, but that doesn't mean they don't have balls. Who's to say? Actually, you know what? This is a Bethesda game. I'm sure someone's modded balls onto ghouls. I still don't know entirely what's happening with the ghouls. I'll be honest, but... Okay, did you... Ghouls are people that got exposed to immense amounts of radiation. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wait, my armor condition's low. Hey, hey, my armor's condition's low. Back off, my armor condition's low. Oh my god, Jesus fuck. <laughs> I have to turn the game down. It's really fucking loud. <laughs> I'm like looking at OBS and she is like top of the fuck out. Wait, I'm crippled again? Yes, Whoa. your arm is crippled. Well, put it back. I don't that's, know. That's, like... what that's what stim packs are for. You have oh, okay. magic medicine. Mmm, stimmy. No, don't take it here. Oh, why? Stats. Stat? What? Stats panel. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Status. Okay. Oh, Apply no. Yay. If you take it in the aid menu, it heals your HP. If you take it here, it heals limbs. Mm, okay. That makes sense. Okay. That's My gay awakening was the ghoul from Fallout 4. <laughs> You're talking about oh god, what's his it, name? Uh, what? Hamish. Are you see that? I haven't played Fallout 4. This is my first Fallout game ever. So like, when you say like my gay awakening was the ghoul, I'm like Hancock, this guy, Hancock. this That's, guy, no, no, this guy. this is your man's. No, there are not. This non, is your man. There are non-feral ghouls. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Because I was about to say I'm like. So so ghouls are people who were exposed to. I don't want to judge, but but they have a genetic disposition where instead of dying they mutate. 
That's right. Uh, I remember they, how that they, works. They become immortal functionally, but if they continue being exposed to radiation, they mentally degrade and become fair. Ghoul cock. Gawk. Tool captain. Whoa! I accidentally took glue. Okay. What was your gay awakening, David? I, I, I haven't had one? Yet! Oh my god. There's still time. I don't know. I think my gay awakening, honestly, was, um... You remember Monster High Dolls? Yes. That that shit made me gay. And, like, I was always gay with my Barbies. Like, I'll be real with you. I always, like, made my Barbies, like, scissor and shit in the dream house. But, like, I don't know. I Something about the Monster High Dolls. I think it's just because I like goth women. You do realize yes, you're like walking in the I'm walking in Legs, look at this stream! <laughs> Welcome to the stream. We're talking about our gay awakening. You're walking in circles still. Where am I going? Okay, I I'm, I start. I got distracted talking about the go, the ghoul cock, and now I don't know where I'm going. Where am I going? Did you ever know where you were going? No. Yeah, I know. That's what you're here for. Okay, all right. Give it. Give. Go up the stairs. Okay, up the stairs. Yes. Okay. Now what? Okay, turn left. Take it back now, y'all. Now open the door. <laughs> Oh, hole. Okay, so do I go down the hole? No, this is the hole you just went down. Oh. This was a test. You have failed. Um, You're so mean to me. Yes, I know. Oh. Go back out into the main hallway. No hole. Okay. Uh, there's like people. The pole dancing and panty and stocking. You're real for that. Okay, you, you're going backwards. Sorry. Okay. No, I, I can't be gay anymore. I have to do directions. I, you can't be gay and follow directions. I. Left. Where are we? Left. Okay. Okay, now turn right past this column. Column. <laughs> okay. What is it? Stop. Mm? What's in that spooky hallway? It's yellow, and that yeah. one's not yellow. Yeah, uh-huh. Go inside. Well, when you say like that, I don't want to. Go into the hallway, Evie. Okay, all okay, right. Okay, now what? Hey, there's a door you haven't opened. Oh. Oh, wow, more offices. Well, this sucks. Well, you haven't been here yet. What's this? Kitchen? That the kitchen is a privilege and not a right. Please clean up after yourselves. Remember that a clean kitchen is a happy kitchen. Oh my god, this is like my old school. At the old school I used to work at, literally every week we got an email that was like, please remember to keep your lunches out of the, um, out of the, um, the communal fridge. There's rats in there. And I'll be like, what? So, like, apparently people would just, like, leave, like, random food in there for, like, months and stuff. And, like, at first I was like, maybe that's just how working in, like, a group, like, thing is, you know? But at my other school, uh, we didn't get emails like that at all. But apparently someone left, like, a pack of raw chicken in the employee fridge at my old school. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't work there anymore, but, we, you know. We have people with, like, mini fridges in their office and shit, and everyone's responsible enough that we don't end up with pests. It's that's the great. thing is, we, uh, we technically aren't allowed to have mini fridges in our classrooms rooms but uh i don't care so you know <laughs> where am i going i forgot you, you never knew why you gotta say it like that? i'm going to stop you once you're walking in circles i didn't take my adhd meds today by the way just so we are all on the same page i usually okay i usually don't take them on the weekends but maybe i should start doing that since i stream on the weekends now i don't know because my mind is like oh okay i don't have work today i can be off my shits it's fine and then it's like wait I have to be an internet funny man. Um, what what is this? Got this it. is a safe. It is. It's lock pick skill of fifty, but it says it's average. Yeah, the, the gate the gate for picking average locks is fifty. Why is it saying I'm below yeah. average? <gasps> Dogma! Thank you so much for the three months. You now have three PlayStation twos. Thank you, Gamer. I appreciate you. Thank you. Were you be you being this incoherent? Okay, that that works. Okay, it's it's kind of like it's like a this could be like a you know how some VTubers they do the like the you know what I'm talking about, David? They do the like the ASMR where it's like walk around with me on a date, but instead of like on a date, this is like you're like third wheeling or you could be like a third in general like up to you you could choose your own adventure like me you and david me chat and david we're all holding hands and we're all like you can unlock that door that's a very easy door oh okay i can do that one. Oh, it says my skills 27 i feel like 27 is a good number though it's a bad number out of 100 oh it's out of 100 what that makes sense stop do not just jump into the hole. That is the office that you were in earlier. Oh, that's the, the, the thingy. Okay. 
So what you're saying is you're giving us a chance with David. I mean, that's the thing is I don't mind doing girlfriend experience as long as you accept that you're also getting a boyfriend experience. But that's the thing. It's really a two for one deal. You know, like I don't see the downside in that. Why well, have one bitch wanna... when you can have two? Why have two bitches when you can have ten? Like, come you on. You might want to loot all the miscellaneous containers that you're walking past. Cause what are the miscellaneous have... containers? The desks. Garbage, garbage can? cans. The Why would I look? Cabinets. You got you got mad at me when I rummaged through the garbage. No, you're supposed to do that. Um, Oh. I got mad at you when you were rummaging through the same garbage five times in a row. Well, now I'm over cucumbered. <laughs> Look what you did. I'm over cucumbered. I'm trying to save you from the many times that you've been like, oh shit, I'm out of bullets. Oh shit, I'm out of bullets. What's oh, a shit, bitter I'm out drink? Of it's a bitter drink. Huh. Um. What's a. I don't know why my tits didn't work just now because I. Here. My tits didn't work. Hold on. Let me. Let me make sure I. Let me make sure I beat my beat myself up for Twitch. Cause that didn't work for some reason. There you go, bud. There you go, just for you. Okay. Um, the big book of science. Oh yeah, isn't that like a temporary thing though? And the programmer's digest, aren't these temporary? No, programmer's digest is a magazine that is temporary. Big book of science is a skill book that is permanent. I could do more drugs. Don't do drugs. Okay. Um, That's not gonna help hmm. you. Just drop some miscellaneous stuff that you're gonna- that What? You're gonna um, okay, miscellaneous. Bobby pin, that's my lockpicks. No. I don't need this. How do I drop again? It's shift something? It's, it's shift right click. Okay. Don't or need... Maybe, no, no, so. no, the caravan desk, deck... Is that like drop. a... Okay. Um, don't I need the cigarettes? You are going to sell They're, they're good to you're sell, gonna, right? You're yeah. You're carrying around a chessboard for some reason. Oh. Well, what if I get bored? <laughs> you're carrying around <laughs> you a said conductor. that and then I see Chad's message in chat. I'm sure we're going to need that chessboard. We're not going to need the chessboard. <laughs> what if we want to play a game? What's a conductor? Uh, it's an electronic part. We're not getting rid of Dinky. No, you I can will, keep Dinky. Dinky. I will kill myself. Dinky weighs a tenth I will of kill a myself in Minecraft before I get rid of Dinky. Okay. On God. Okay. Right. Uh, what, what's it? Yeah. What's a conductor? It, it's an electronics part. Do you think five weight for thirty caps is worth it? No, probably not. Okay, but you, can you know. Drop that. Do, you, Do I need the dog hide? It's weightless. You can carry as many of those as you want. Okay. What's the flamer fuel tank? It's what is that? It's also weightless. Don't worry about it. What? Oh yeah, these are all weightless. Uh, empty sunset sarsaparilla bottle. I don't think you bottle. need the empty bottle. I don't yeah, think you need the empty bottle. Yeah, you're probably right. Oh, uh, that's legion money. Well, I, I don't need the lottery tickets, but they also. They don't weigh anything. You can drop them. They don't really matter. Yeah. Um, do I... You're carrying around four pounds of scrap electronics and ten pounds of scrap metal. Do I need that? Uh, I think you were carrying them around to repair Eddie at one point, and then you forgot about Eddie. Oh, yeah. Well, should we go back and do that? Well, you know, I mean, if you want to hold on to it for a bit. Yeah, Eddie back. was cool. He was nice. Uh, the bottle caps I want. Do I need... The canteens will let me... Oh, why do I have Wonder Glue? I do not know why you're carrying around three bottles. A <laughs> uh, key ring. Oh, that that's... holds all your keys. You need that. Well, now I am 10 pounds lighter. Okay, why don't you check your weapons? Oh, yeah. Maybe there's things okay. that you can repair. Uh, let's we see. We might want to just... Why is binoculars a weapon? Because you use it like a gun. That's so dumb. Because that makes it, me think I'm going to, like, go up to some guy and beat the shit out of him no, with a it, pair of binoculars. It's how the engine makes it work. Oh. Are you going to realistically use the minigun you're hauling around? No, but I thought it was neat. <laughs> um, oh, God. I just lost, like, 70 billion pounds with that. It's like I just took a shit after Hibachi. Holy fuck. Um, hmm. But that is what you use to gain knowledge, and knowledge is power. Knowledge well, is power. Well, but the thing is, it doesn't matter if you're smart here, because it's the apocalypse. So it's like, it does, like, you okay. just sh kill people. Then do you want to not carry around binoculars? Well, no, what if I need them? Okay. To beat the shit out of somebody. <laughs> what is it going to look like when I... <laughs> I don't know why this is so funny to just me. Just hope fools don't learn how to use a mini gun. That's a great line to... What do we say? What do we say, chat? When is a good time to enter an Eevee game stream? <laughs> Never. <laughs> Welcome, big gamers. Okay, do I have to do like a hopscotch type move? I mean, you can just go down if you wanted. Oh, I thought I wasn't supposed to go in the hole. I mean, you, you're kind of retracing your steps, but I think there's more to look at down here. So okay. it's not the end of the world if you do. Okay. Um, Three weapons okay. max. I feel like I have like seven. <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. Someone's like moaning. But not in a good way. Hold up. Who, who the fuck is that? Someone's... Who? 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 Maybe it's more ghoul. Oh, blah, 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 blah. oh shit. Blah, 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 blah. Ah. The gun is, like, slow. Why is it slow? It's a full auto gun. Yeah, I'm like, why is it... Did I accidentally, like, press something to make it, like... Stop! 
Oh, Stop! Good. Yeah, I don't know what it's doing. Stop! Go away! Right. Stranger danger! Use, use a different gun. Use a different gun. Okay, you no know more. This gun is lame. I want a different one. They're growling. Okay, listen. I listen. Um, service. Did I? Okay, last time I used the grenade Do not rifle. Grenade rifle indoors. <laughs> yeah. Stopping you now. You also. I'm gonna remind you. You have not. Don't use the sound. You use the use the cowboy repeater. Oh, that's my old reliable. That's right. Okay, you guys need to back off. Back off. You're in my bubble. This is my personal bubble. Well, oh, v right. But v Wait, what? <laughs> oh, he's reloading. I didn't know what he was doing. I saw him just like, duh, 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 and okay. I was like, the before fuck? you go further, okay. please save. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to do this again. <laughs> you could quick save too. F5 oh, I forgot. Quick. Oh, it's the same as Skyrim. It is the okay. Same as Skyrim. Okay, yeah, he looked like he was, I'm gonna, I don't wanna be like, okay, I'm trying to be more cognizant of how many, like, lewd jokes I make, right? Because, like, I, a streamer I really like recently was like, it's kind of annoying when people only joke about, like, lewd stuff, and I was like, you know what, That that's right, I get that, and I don't wanna be, like, annoying, you know? Hey, what's that glowing ash pile? Rebar club. Hey, where have you seen a rebar club before? Wasn't that that guy? What guy? The, 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 the big man. Yeah, yeah. The robot man. What? The, 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 the at the beginning. What the fuck? No, no, no. It, there, there, there was a big guy, and he was, like, the, he had the arms, and he was, like, kind of blue. Okay, that wasn't a robot. What was that, then? That was a nightkin. Well, he was a big guy. Oh, uh, yes, but it was not a robot. He had a cowboy hat. I think. Are you thinking of Victor? No, no, I'm not thinking of Victor. No, he was a he was a violent guy. I, I only held it by you or me. It was a mutant, but right, he right. looked kind of like a robot. No, he didn't. Anyway. I'm not wearing my glasses are, in real life. Are you are you starting to put together the pieces yet? No. Okay. All right. Well, we'll, we'll get there eventually. Mm. But anyway, as I was saying, I don't want to like be. Oh, in hey, look, the main factory floor. Oh. Yeah, it was this also, guy. You, okay. Are you are we putting together the pieces yet? I think I thought he was a robot because for some reason, do you remember in the original Half-Life? <laughs> oh my God. The, the, the guy, he's got, do you remember in the original Half-Life when there was the big blue guy and he like spat fire and like shit like that? And you know, thank you for the hydrate. <laughs> That's what he reminded me of. I don't know why, but he reminded me of the big, the, the big transformer looking fella in, in Half-Life. Okay, so, so hold on. Turn around. Turn around. Do I need Walk that? Out. No, no. Because I don't want it. Walk down the stairwell. Oh, isn't this where I'm supposed to go? Uh, it's one of the places you wanted to go, yeah. Well, I should probably heal first. Because I'm kind of, like, not okay, looking then, too hot. Take some stim packs. Okay, a stimmy. Um, no, not, not, I mean, either take them, you can take them there. Or take it through my the... My leg's not looking too hot. Okay, or take it through the aid menu to actually regain HP. Supernova! Welcome in, gamer! Thank you so much for the eight months. You have eight PlayStations. I finally made it to a stream. I missed you. How was your How was your break? How was your time in the ocean? Didn't you go? Did you go? I might be thinking of someone else, but didn't you go to the sea? Didn't you go to the ocean? It was the original Half Life, like the one from like 1998. There was like a guy, and it was right before you got to on a rail. I don't remember what it's called. Hey, so you didn't heal. Oh fuck! Right. <laughs> I, I saw me being crippled, but that's about it. Items. Items. That's right. Okay. Aid. Aid. This is where you actually will regain HP. Uh, I did. I missed the sun. Well, welcome uh, back. Side note: You are dr carrying around like Nuka Cola and Squirrel on a Stick and water that all will heal you over time. That is also weighing you down. Oh. Well, let me take all of those then, and that <laughs> should that should work. Yeah, I remember because I remember. You literally were like, yeah, I'm going out to sea. And then the Ocean Gate thing happened. And I was like, you know, it would be a really crazy coincidence, but I hope Supernova's okay. <laughs> so I'm glad to hear that you're okay. I hope you enjoyed your time with the ocean. I'm glad to see you back, gamer. But yeah, it was the, like the OG Half-Life. And it was like right before on a rail because he was blocking the area. I remember this. I, I fucking love the original Half-Life. He was blocking the area and you had to go like turn on the water, turn on the air, and then something happened and you set him on fire. Or some, or no, you didn't set him on fire. You just had to like, I think you just had to run really fast. I don't remember. But 
He oh, was no, blue. I'm sorry, you don't need to come down here yet. You can turn around. Oh. Yeah, you no, lied you're, to you're me. You're supposed to go upstairs first. That's uh, my bad. Have you played Half-Life on the channel? It was years ago. I'm going to grab a sandwich. I've been here 10 minutes and I'm already stressed out. Yeah. yeah welcome <laughs> to my life. Oh, Jesus Christ. So I haven't Wrong played. Life. Oh, right. I haven't played OG Half-Life on this channel. Well, I did for a little bit, but not for like a very long time. But I did play through Black Mesa. And the Half-Life franchise is one of my my favorite franchises of the the time ever. Oh, ew, they're, they're icky. It says um, <laughs> What? Oh, it does say empty, yeah. I missed it. Um, so, try mm. to go upstairs. Like up here? Yeah, get up on the catwalk. Ooh, I see. But yeah, I played, um, I did play Black Mesa on stream, and Half-Life was like the first, like, I have like really fond memories of it because Half-Life was my first like big kid game franchise because I remember telling my dad I liked video games and at the time um, Pretty much my only exposure to like non like girly games and don't get me wrong. I love girly games, hey, wait, right? We, we need a key. Oh, okay All right, smooth skin. I'm letting you in. You better watch yourself. I'll sure as hell be watching you. Okay. But that's the thing, is like, don't get me wrong, I love girly games. I will absolutely God, fuck up some Barbie you horse adventure. Ugly. What? Get upstairs and talk to Jason before I throw up just from looking at you. Well, fuck you too! Okay, um... Big man Pingus ugly. Well, how could you ever call big man Pingus ugly? He is peak male condition. Okay, uh, hold on. I'm not sure about that. You're not a ghoul. Your pranks won't work on me, smooth skin. They won't work on Jason either. Who the fuck's Jason? You're, you're gonna need to find out. Uh, you you look pretty smooth. Like you use he's that bald like. And everything. Yeah, he's bald. His head's probably like shiny. You could like smack it and it vibrate. Stop what? wasting You've my time. You've never smacked the bald guy's head. Skin. What? They like vibrate. Reasons. No, you like smack it and it's like there's like a reverb to it. You remember? No. What? Well, you need to start smacking okay, some right. bald guys, David. I don't know what to tell you. I'll find a bald guy to slap later. Yeah. But anyway, um, basically, my dad was like, okay, you want to play, like, a real video game? And I was like, yeah. And I played uh, through the original Half-Life franchise uh, on my dad's computer on his Steam account. And I remember getting to the end of Half-Life 2, Episode 2, and being like, where's Half-Life 3, Dad? And he looked at me, he was like, hey there. There is no Half-Life 3. And I cried so hard I threw up. So, you know. That was my exposure to gaming. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the franchise, the totally finished franchise with an ending that they finished. Totally. <laughs> what, what are these? Oh, they're, 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 they're just glowy. Like, oh. they look like orange, like Fanta. Listen, it's, it's a lighting engine from 2007. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm not saying it's a bad thing. It's kind of delectable, you know what no, I'm saying? No, do not eat the rat away. I don't know, you know? Um, how, how you doing, bud? That's not, you, you, you followed him. He told you to talk to Jason. Okay, well, wh where's Jason? Uh, you Jason! Have, you, you have a compass. Jason, it's uh. like heavy rain. Jason! Jason! <laughs> Jason! Wait, I thought it was Sean at heavy rain. <laughs> Wasn't one of them Jason? Am I, oh, Jason! Jason! Hello, Wanderer. Please forgive us our humble surroundings. Our true home awaits us in the far beyond. Have you come to help he us complete the great like journey? He kind of looks like a pumpkin, but on, like, November 15th. Yeah? You know what I'm saying? He, like, he, when you've had a jack-o'-lantern out for a really long time? He, he does kind of look like a sad gourd. Oh, you sad gourd man. <laughs> hey, remember when we bought those gourds that we thought were fake decorative gourds, and then we stored them, and then they weren't? <laughs> <laughs> so, David and I went to Giant, and during, like, um, right, like, right before Halloween, and we bought these, like, little gourds, because we was like, oh, we can put them on the table, that'll be so cute, and we, like, knocked them out, and David's like, oh, yeah, these are fake, and I was like, oh, okay, so we put them away, and then we were cleaning out our closet <laughs> to reorganize it, and I was like, David, something smells a little weird, <laughs> and we opened up the thing, and it's just, like, it was the worst thing I had ever seen was, in my life, it felt like we found a dead body, it was disgusting, uh, I'm but, like, oh, shit, I guess they weren't fake. Yeah, it was it, it was bad. Um, they felt like wax fruit. They, yeah, it was... Well, are gourds fruit? Aren't they vegetables? This is one of those things where it's like, technically it's one thing, functions as another. I mean, like, keep in mind that nothing we call a berry is actually a berry, but a, but a banana is. Isn't a pineapple so, like, also a berry or some I, weird yeah, shit? Yeah, it's, it's, it's fucking... Fruit is weird. Fruit is weird. Uh, anyway, back to Jason Bright. Who are you? I am Jason Bright. Hi, Jason. The prophet of the great journey. Jesus. Ghoul Jesus? All the ghouls you see here are members of my flock. Jesus! Um, 
Uh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. I could just be a dick here, really. Uh, tell me more about these demons, Mr. Pumpkin Man. The demons appeared from nowhere. Except it might be more accurate to say they never actually appeared Jack Skellington looking ass. The demons Listen. are invisible. Listen. Where one of them stands, Thank you for the clips, the by the way, gamers. Those help me out a lot. shimmering like sunlight on water. They set upon us as we were on our way to worship one morning. We had just entered the basement. I feel like if I, like, flock gave him my handshake, he'd start, like, flaking. Few. But at such cost, that, yeah, probably. nearly half of us died You're not or went missing. The rest of us retreated up here. One of the demons raved at us. But they have not I need to replay this game with one intelligence. If it makes Still, you feel better, I'm doing that in real life. It's brought you, all progress towards the great journey to a standstill. Oh. But now ah, you I have see. come. Once again, the creator has Pull sent a human to help us across a seemingly insurmountable obstacle. Yeah, oh yeah, I did want, I remember, I wanted to make my intelligence one and David wouldn't let me. Um, you say one of the demons raved at you? Did they try to give you like a candy bracelet? Like, does he not like Plur? Is that the vibe? Yes, over the intercom. All of Evie's intellect points IRL are music. I tell my students this because sometimes, so Lux is actually one of my students. Uh, I tell all my students this. I am very smart at teaching sense. and I'm very smart at music. I am dumb as fuck when then? it comes to everything else. I've Silence. specked into those two areas. Will that's all I got, okay? Wander. I don't know what a fraction is and I don't care, okay? That's, that's how I am. Uh, I'll take care of the demons for you. Praise the creator. Bless you, Wanderer. Bless Kumbaya! us all. Yay! As soon as the underground has been rid of demons, preparations you don't want to know what special stats I mean. Well, now I kind of want to. Uh, okay. Well, I kind of want to get... Let me get a look at you. He's a glowing one. Hmm. Is that why he's like Jesus? Because he glows? Uh, no. It, it means that he has even more radiation than the average ghoul. Crack that man like a glow stick. Yeah, pretty much. Wait, how do I show people my character again? Because there's some new faces in chat, and I want to show them the peak male performance of Big Man Pingus. Hold on F. Hold on F. They call him ugly. <laughs> Why would they call Big Man Pingus ugly? I think, respectfully. What? They're on to something. Uh. No, no. Big Man Pingus. See? See? He's so, looking. He's like, hey. So did, did, you, did you notice anything weird about the guy who let you in? No. Oh, well, he wasn't a smooth skin, or, or he, he was... You, no, he is. That's the problem. Wait, what? He's Wait, a let me, person. Let me get a look at him. Hold on. Well, I mean, ghouls are people, too. But, like, he's not... <laughs> he's he's human. He's, he's left the room. Oh, shit. Where Where is he? Where is this guy? I want, I want, a lab coat. He's I want to get a look at him. Coats, so yeah, this guy. He looks like a... Hey. Hey. Go bother Jason, smooth skin. I don't like having you around. Yeah, he just kind of looks like a sad Dr. Phil. Yeah, but he's Stay just away guy, from me. But he's hanging out with the ghouls. It's weird, well, right? You know, we can all be a little Delulu for fun. Uh, you know, it's, it's oh, fine. Okay. So are you going to go to the basement and clear out the demons? Yeah. Uh, how well, do I get to the basement? The... I'm trying to follow the compass, but okay, I follow so, the compass so, very literally. So step one to finding the basement would probably be go downstairs. Going down, yeah. <laughs> do you know how to use a fire extinguisher? Hey. Nope. <laughs> No, I do not. Ghouls are humans, just crispy. Mmm, I like my people extra crispy. KFC, baby. All right, I'm so assuming. There are, yeah, you need to go back down there. Yeah, yeah, there yeah. are ghouls that have been around since the bombs dropped. That's crazy. So, like, does being a ghoul make them, like, immortal yeah, or you, some you shit? Yeah, you stop aging. Oh. Ghouls are humans, but just rotting. So, uh, they, so they do well, die, but just, like, slower than everything else? Genetically, I, I'm, I'm going to borrow a line from... Uh, everyone's favorite Fallout character, Moira Brown. Mm. Uh, genetically, they were human until radiation played with their DNA like a kitten with a ball of yarn. Oh. Uh, at this point, I'm not sure genetics have anything to do with anything anymore. Stop, Sonny. So, do you understand now why that ash pile holding a rebar club is suspicious? Oh! Yeah. Okay. Um... Rut row raggy. That's all I gotta say. Um, let me see where. I, I want to say something to chat, but I couldn't remember what to do. So I just wait. Is there a guy? Oh no. Well, so now you need to clear the nightkin out from down here. The fuck are the nightkin? Uh, the the blue guys. 
Oh, the big boys. Yeah, okay, the big guys. boys. Okay, I'm gonna be sneaky beaky. Okay, so that's a dead guy. Um, yeah, I wonder what killed him. His head's gone. Oh, well, that sounds like a personal I, problem. I, I wonder what's on the other side of that door. The, the, the door that you may or may not have been directed to at one point. Oh. Oh, okay. Is this gonna scare me? It might. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Don't shoot him. Oh, that's a friend. Okay. <laughs> God, I, was, I was watching you like that. Hey, I was like, wait. You're not one of those things out there. Who the hell are you? Uh, Jason sent me to get rid of the demons. And I bet he told you it's the creator's oh. will for you to risk your ass instead of him, right? Well, good luck with that. I'd give you a hand, but no thanks. I may no look thanks. like a corpse, but I'm partial to living. He sounds like he's, like, trying to be edgy. Brandon, thank you so much for the sub. You now have a PlayStation 2. Congratulations. Thank you for the support, gamer. I appreciate it. Thank you for hydrate. He absolutely is. Yeah, he sounds like, like, you know those guys that, like, try to pretend to have a deep voice because they want to be, like, corpse husband they want to be, like, sexy or some shit? No. He sounds like that. Well, clearly you've never been an e-kitten uh, thief. That is true. I haven't. Would you like to start? Maybe. <laughs> there you have it, fellas! <laughs> uh, how'd you get trapped down here? First off, I'm not trapped. I mean, if your vocal cords were melted, you'd sound choice, edgy, too. Right? Yeah, that's true. I'm no match One for endurance. <laughs> One intelligence. So I found a good defensive One position. agility. And I've been defending Just like me, for real, right? for real. You got a lotion oh, ad stuff! I'm trapped. <laughs> he Name's Harlan. He just needs some Olay! What happened was, I was escorting folks down to work. When those things attacked us. Took me like you Most hate me. <laughs> That's what he sounds like to me. I'm sorry. But some folks panicked. And they the Batman. <laughs> and I went after him. Well, turns out there were even more I just of those think he, I, down here I can't upstairs. take him seriously because now I'm thinking he's like a knockoff fast. corpse husband. I couldn't find the others. <laughs> so I fell back to this room. Set up a nice little kill zone. Oh, some Rimworld type story. shit. I like it. Set up his own kill Discount box. Batman! I don't know, sometimes I want to play RimWorld on, on the channel again, but it never it never ends well. <laughs> it never ends well. Um You don't look like the other ghouls. <laughs> You're not like other ghouls. <laughs> Guess the outfit gives that away, huh? I never did buy into that religious mumbo jumbo with the robes and all that shit. Okay. Gets lonely out in the wastes, okay? I'm gonna eat a and pickle while I don't have to tell you, monologue, that Bryce man. group has got some fine-looking goulettes in it. By the uh, way, or maybe I would have to tell you. Go to your local you. Amish market. Anyway, I'm telling you, the I Amish make out. the best fucking pickles. They kept me supplied like with ammo and pleasant Amish company. Markets. Well, go to one that has an Amish market. These pickles are fucking delicious. Um, how can I help you get out? Huh? Well, you're polite. I'll give you that. Tips hat. If this was just between you and me, you have swallowed I'd do as you ask. Al Pacino. <laughs> but it's not. I had a friend with me when those mutant bastards yeah, He's really just going, nowhere. so I'm like taking this time to, to she eat my pickles. and ran the wrong direction. Girl dinner. Further into the basement. Girl dinner. She's probably dead. But I ain't leaving until I know for sure. I'd Are have you gone looking myself. Except I wouldn't last a minute yeah. out there. You, on the other hand, <laughs> seem pretty resourceful. Find my friend. And I'll get out of your way. Okay. Um, a little bit. Is that like a good thing or a bad thing? <laughs> uh, you only have one pickle left. So. All right. Well, I'm gonna let him continue to monologue while I while I eat this last pickle. Uh, I'll try to find your friend. Thanks. Let me know what you find out. Here's hoping she's okay. Okay. All right. That's the last pickle. Um. Don't walk into the room. He will kill you if you walk into the room. So go away. Okay. Mom. Well, we have to find to his friend. Okay, well, let's save. Wait, wait save. Fuck. I have to get used to that. Okay, so we're gonna go find his friend. Um, okay, hopefully. Hmm? Turn left. I think you should go through that door. Why? I, I just think you should. What? Why? Because Rune is also saying go to the left, so I and want, I don't. I feel like I'm being conspired I'm gonna, listen, against. Listen, I'm gonna. I want you to walk up. I want you to open that door. I want you to not shoot the thing right uh, that you're going to see. I want you. I'm to not talk gonna to get him. jump scared. Do not. Don't shoot. Just talk to the guy. Uh, okay, okay. Well, everyone's saying to do it, so I, I guess I'll do it. He's friendly. Go, go, go have a What's chat. What's that, Antler? We have a visitor. Big boy! I say kill it, Antler, for safe sake. Antler. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, Antler, I'll ask. That's Antler. Oh! Hi, Truman, in case Hi. you caught that connection. He's, um, he's talking to a Brahmin skull. Oh, are, are you okay? I am in command of my faculties. In Can't command relate. of my troops. Oh. Antler guides me in all things as I, in turn, guide my kin. Um, I came here on behalf of the ghouls upstairs. A human who is friend to ghouls? Suspicious. He called me suspicious. You meet the ones upstairs. Friends. Antler used intercom. Anyway. Told them stay put, but they want to come down in basement anyways. I cannot allow. My kin are... Not right in head like I am. They attack you on sight. Okay. Ghouls too. They crazy. <laughs> Your ghoul friends have to wait until you find what Antler brought us to get. What, what are you guys getting? McDonald's? Um, they all eat the grimace meal, and that's why they're blue now. That yeah, that's what happened. That's the lore. I've decided. Um, uh, maybe I can help. Good. Antler brought us here for a reason. Why was that, Antler? Right, a, a piece of paper, shipment invoice, hundreds of stealth boys sent here a, a long time ago. That do. But stealth boys must be in the one room, one we don't search yet. I can see how the they're the best super mutants, because he's, he's jacked as fuck, bro. Like, I mean, he's like, all oh super, my god. All super mutants are pretty much that big. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, they, these ones are just addicted to machines that make you invisible. Oh. That's what stealth boys are. They're, they're little. Yeah, I, I was wondering what those they're were. They're self contained cloaking devices. I think you have one. I do. I, I think I have like uh, two of them or something. The, oh, for the, the issue, shipment. <laughs> the issue is is that they burn out. Oh. So they're not like infinite. Yeah, okay. I, I will find the stealth boy stock file for you if your kin will leave this place alone. Yes, Antler says we leave here as soon as we are, get stealth are you, boys. Are you seeing the conundrum here? Let me give you key. Antler had me lock the door. I'm not connecting the, the ghoul dots. inside. What's the not expecting so a human. The, Maybe the, he don't shoot you. Maybe he right. will. The nightkin want the stealth boys that are in the room with the ghoul you just talked to, but he won't leave until you tell him whether or not his friend is alive. Oh, hmm. So I have to pick a side then. Well, yeah, or I mean, you, you could just go salt and earth and just kill all the suit, all the nightkin, if you wanted to. I like um, Mr. Big Boy. Okay, well then you're gonna need to find uh, the guy's friend. They cause schizophrenia. Oh. Yeah, they they cause schizophrenia. For free? For free. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I like him. He seems like a, a nice fella. Okay. All right. So we're gonna need to find what's his face's friend then. Friend. Um. Don't, don't fuck with Antler. What happens if I, like, shoot it? Will he aggro? I would save before you find I kinda out. I kind of want to find out what happens. That is what happens. Okay, good to know. I wanted to see if he'd react, because sometimes you do shit in these types of games and they, no one gives a shit, okay? I just wanted to see what would happen, okay? No, no, Obsidian actually tried to make an interesting and interactive game. Okay. Uh, unlike some people. Uh, are you good? Did you? He just like out of nowhere went. Ah! Um, yeah, they do that. Okay, so what's the plan then? If I want him to be my friend, you're, you're gonna need to go find the the ghoul's friend. Okay. Uh, who's behind door number two? Yeah, you. So keep in mind, um, all the nightkin are probably invisible. Oh, I don't like that. Yeah. Hi, Boston. Hey, there's a switch that says stairs. Huh? On the wall. Huh? Behind you. Huh? Right there. Oh. You did a really good job with tracking for your mom today. Thank you. I think the reason my tracking has been fucked up recently is um our lamp ate shit. Um, <laughs> so the lighting in the room was really bad. So I think now that my lighting is better, it'll be a little bit smoother. Wow. Okay. Um, but thank you. Um, but that's uh, Obsidian gives a shit. That's fair. That's why we can't blame Todd Howard. Listen. Every Obsidian game that's come out so far has been fantastic, and I'm convinced that about is going to be much better than the, than the new Elder Scrolls game. But uh, we'll see. Going down a tunnel. I have opinions. Do, do you want to give your opinions? Do you want to no. give your hot takes? No. Oh, okay. You David deserve, loves to give you his don't hot takes. You deserve my hottest takes. Why not? Why don't we get your hot takes? The, the, you don't. You're not ready for my hottest. No, takes. No, give us your hot takes. Maybe one day. Secret tunnel. Yeah, five subs for David's high takes. <laughs> I mean, listen, I'm, I'm not going to say no, but, like, you don't have to. Potion seller. 
I would like your finest hot takes. Hot takes cakes. Hot takes cakes. David, will you give one hot take for free? Uh, d about what? I don't know. Um, do you have anything you'd like to, like, you think more people should know about that's, like, controversial? You want to talk about Pathfinder? You want to talk about why you don't like D&D 5e? I that always gets him riled up. I don't think up. you want that rant right now. That's a big rant. He, David's got lots of opinions. Ah, oh, give me a- wait, wait a second. Wait a minute. Aren't you... Wait a minute. Kimia's already a VIP. Don't you get... Don't don't you now get... What level of VIP are you on, Kimia? Are you on VIP... This is your third VIP. Okay, I think after third VIP, you get VIP Tokyo Drift. I think that's what happens yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. If a mod could Drift. give uh, her in this in Discord the VIP three role and yeah. then VIP Tokyo Drift. <laughs> I don't know. The people seem to want your rant, David. Uh, What's your speak your truth? Oh, there's a, that's a Foot Locker. I thought it was just a, what was in here. That's the Foot Locker. Camera and uh, scrap okay, metal. Something useful. Okay. I don't want anything. We'll go in this one, and we'll see what happens. It goes VIP, VIP two, VIP Tokyo Drift, and then Nun Puncher. That's right. I forgot. I forgot about four. Nun Puncher. I forgot tier four was Nun Puncher. So basically, the skinny is if you um, get stream VIP. Um, I can't give you, hmm? oh shit, I can't Turn give you, left. um, like, the sub roles okay. on Twitch that, um, Twitch gives, like, I can't give you access to emotes, but pretty much if you're a stream VIP, uh, you get an eternal access to, um, the sub-only channels in the Discord and stuff like that. It is my little way of saying thank you for watching my stream. So, that is kind of what VIP entails. So, th this hmm. is, th the important oh, thing medics. here. Yeah, the, the medics, there's a stim pack, there's Stimmy? some mentats. But here's the thing, look out Menthols. the window. Huh? Look out the, the window to turn left. What are no the windows? Right. Walk forward. That's not a window, no, that's wait, a microwave. Left. Oh! Oh. Oh. Oh, these are... Are those nukes? No. Because they kind of look like the rockets from Pizza Planet. That They are kind of the rockets from Pizza Planet. From Toy Story. Do you remember where you are? No. The Repcon Rocket Facility? Oh, I was thinking of Nevada. The Repcon Rocket Facility? Well, I guess it makes sense that there's rockets in the rocket facility when you phrase it like that. Here, and, I gotta and, move. And I'm gonna spill mind, pickle juice all over the place. The ghouls are here because they want to go to mm -hmm. the Great Beyond. Do you get a special little badge in chat? Yes, if you're a VIP, you get a little diamond next to your name. So if you see someone with a little diamond, uh, they are they are a VIP, a VIP. Retro futurism rockets. What the fuck does that mean? You know how Epcot was is is, is the future, but yeah. twenty years ago. Yeah. That's retro futurism. Is what people used to think the future would look like. Oh. So the aesthetic of like the Jetsons. Yeah. Okay. And, and that this, makes sense. This is retro futurism. That makes sense. Okay. Welcome in, Morley. But, but anyway, remember how the ghouls want to go to the Great Beyond? Oh, is this the Great Beyond? Well, and they're here because of that. I'm gonna be honest. I thought it was like a suicide cult, like a no, Heaven's no, Gate no, thing. No, they want to go to space. Oh. Why? Who? Can I see? Can I give my hot take? I'm gonna give a hot take. I don't understand why people want to go to space so bad. Like, what's out there? Well, what are you gonna do? So, like, stare at the scars? I can't do that at my at my own house. So keep in mind, the planet they're on is currently in a radiated hellhole that can't support life. Well, yeah, but like... What if there's another planet out there that could support life? What if there's not? That, well, you know, you, you're, you're trading a maybe there is and a maybe there's not for the, this one definitely sucks. I mean, I guess that's true. Earth kind of blows. That's true. Alien bitches. That's a good argument, actually. That's true. Tentacles. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, also they're immortal, so they can just keep floating for a while. Oh, yeah. I didn't think about that. Do you remember when um the first like woman went to space and they gave her like 500 tampons? That's, that's really funny. It's like kind of fucked up, but it's also really funny. <laughs> so, do you want a space suit? Wait, wait, can no, I wear no, this? Can I wear this? No, I want to wear, wait, 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 wait. The, the show me my... suit is next to it. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want the full suit? Amogus! He oh looks like God. an Amogus! No, Where's the suit? Where's the suit? suit? It's oh, on the shelf oh, next to him. Space suit, okay. Uh, that's a tin can. Okay. That's a pressure cooker. Oh. Oh, okay. <gasps> red sussy! <laughs> <laughs> red! He's red! No! No! He's the imposter! No! No! Okay. Now what? Okay, you 
weren't really supposed to come down here yet. Oh. Um, go back up the tunnel. I like my spacesuit though. I, I think that I think this was a net positive, actually. Okay, what do I go up the ladder? Um, I What's forget what that leads, actually. I think it might lead outside. Let's invest in McGee, just for the fun. Yeah, it leads outside. Oh, okay, so we don't need to yeah. go there then. Okay. Uh, vault Tech's able to use the vault to do... Oh, yeah! I know, I remember some of it from Fallout 4. And I know David, um, when David and I were still long distance, he used to read to me some of the, like, vault stories as, like, a bedtime oh, story. Oh, real fucked up. Yeah, but it helped me fall asleep. So, you know. No one talk about the gender ones. We don't need to get into it. <laughs> I don't know. You, really you, you read some fucked up shit to me as bedtime stories, but it, like, worked every time. I, I do think the know? funniest one was the one that was 50 men, 50 women, and one p black panther. How'd that end up? Uh, the panther killed people. And then what? That's it. Oh, okay. <laughs> the panther murdered people. What's your favorite Fallout main antagonist? Oh, that's my friend. Okay. He's a, he's a fella. Okay. Yeah, there's the guy with the puppets. Yeah, it's like the puppets. What's the deal with the puppets? Boss. Goose Hunter, thank you so much there, for the follow. You know, I guess I can keep girl boss. Tell us your favorite uh, fucked up Fallout stop, vault story. Stop, stop. Huh? You need to. You still need to find the ghoul's corpse. The ghoul uh, guy's corpse down here. Oh, okay. Let me. I'm looking at my compass, and I'm like, where the fuck? Do I have the right quest like enabled yes, or you whatever? Yes, you do. Okay, so I'm gonna go this way. You might want to put your armor on, by the way. But I like. I see you. Sure. What the fuck? Hey, 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 I'm just a little guy. I'm just a little fella in a space suit. What the, hey, 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 back it up, back it up, buddy, back it up. Don't forget about that. That's, that's, no offense, cause you, but you can't aim for shit. But I have all my points and gun. Stop jumping. I like the one with the one person and heaps of hamsters. Yeah, yeah. How, how'd that end up? It was just one guy and a bunch of hamsters. Did we they have a good time? We don't know how they ended. We just know it happened. Oh, okay. Also, okay. Anyway. stop jumping every time there's an enemy. I that's get why you panicked. I get it. I'm afraid. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, bye, Supernova. Thank you so much for hanging out. And thank you for the resub, Gamer. I appreciate it. What? I, I think that's might have shit the bed. Right click. <clears throat> I, 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 I'm right clicking! David! David! The full attack! Hey! Oh god damn it! I thought. Whoa, 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 Okay. Look at him in this stupid fucking spacesuit! Oh god damn it! Oh shit. But thank you for the posture check. Yeah, you touched Antler. I didn't mean to touch him. Do okay. I have to go do that all again? Listen, you didn't really it. find anything down there besides the space suit. You'll go down there again later. Don't don't bother going back down there right now. Fine. Okay. We saw you killing Medbay. Okay. Yeah, that's cucked me. That's what happened. Okay, David, where do I go? Turn around. Turn around. Every now and then I get Left. a little bit lonely. Beep, 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 uh. Huh? You good? He's, he's not. He just makes Left. some noises sometimes. And like, I make noises. Oh. Hey, 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 Okay. Wait, bah, 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 bah. Click, 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 click. Done. Another one. Perfect. Okay. All right. All right, now you have an action point. Another one. Oh, there's two. Wait, no, 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 no. Oh, oh. Do not leave them into the room with antlers. Oh, shit, 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 shit. No, 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 no. Wait, that's, that's the room with antlers. Room. Fuck. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Repositioning. Oh, shit. That didn't work out for me. Hi, John. Welcome. <laughs> Look out of mine. That wasn't a mine. That was two volars fucking dudes. Okay. okay I'm, I'm going to make a suggestion to you. What? Stop running away. Just huh? shoot them in the face. Okay. Stop running. Don't make a moving target. Just kill them. I'm just going to be confident. Okay? <laughs> I'm going to be confident. Okay? Okay, there's an ad going on. Okay, no one saw me eat, sh eat shit and die then. Okay, that's that's. No, good. they saw you eat shit and die, and then there was an ad. Oh, what, what, what great fucking timing. Can you imagine just, like, here? I, I can't imagine how the EB Games viewer experience must be of hearing me say, like, the most weirdest shit ever. And then, like, like me, didn't I say, like, like flex seal a girl's pussy last Fallout stream? Like, you hear me say that, and then it's just, I'm Natasha, an underworld doctor. Like, that's got to be really, some kind of, like... It's even funnier when the ads cut you off in a rant. <laughs> 
because you'll be because like you'll be like flex seal a pussy clothes and then it'll stop and you have like four minutes of like you know aloe lotion commercials or whatever <laughs> and, and then you come back and you're like so anyway that's Rhodes! Uh, Rhodes, thank you so much for the five gift subs okay well now david david now you know what this means though david now you have to give your hot takes we said five subs for, for a hot take. David, give us your hot takes. I, I will give you hot takes once you don't immediately eat shit to these nightmares. Okay. I'm being confident. Okay. I'm being, I'm having confidence. Look at all those PlayStations, baby. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Rhodes. I appreciate you a lot. And I promise that we, David, will give hot takes, but I just need to show, I need to prove to him that I cannot die, okay? The Gary Volt. So start thinking about what hot take well, you want to no, give, no, David. No, no, what, what hot take do they want? I need Do you want to, well? What are the options? Uh, there's, there's my hot take about uh, the entirety of Bethesda games. Okay. Uh, oh, there's another one. Okay. Okay. I, I have lots of them about tabletop RPGs. Do you want? Okay. Do you want to hear about Bethesda game or tabletop RPG chat? What 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 hot take do you do you desire? Oh, I don't have AP. Okay. Shit. Okay. Oh, but thank you so much for the prize. Oh, fuck! 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 He's gonna. Eat it. Okay, wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. All right, I'm, I'm saving. No, I'm not. I, I didn't have vats, but you, you said not to. Use, you said not to shoot. Bullets. You said that no. I'm bad at shooting and to use vats. Also, okay, okay, okay. Stop running. Stand still. <laughs> shoot things. And don't be hop. Stop running in circles. Just stand still and shoot the thing. Wait, 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 wait. No, fucking. Let me make one joke, just just one little meme, real quick. He fucking. <laughs> can someone please just fucking? <laughs> can someone edit this, please? Cause that's what I thought of. <laughs> that... Why are you running? That's you. <laughs> Why are you running? <laughs> I'm trying to stop us from being here for two more hours of you getting your shit rot by night. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay. All right. All right. Yes, shoot it in the head. There you go. Good job. Look at Pingus. Look at Pingus! Let's go, Pingus! Let's go, big man. Wait, is that another one? No, he's dead. Okay. I timed that poorly. No, that was perfect. Thank you. Uh, all right, you David. It looks like it's time for you to give your, your hot take about uh, tabletop RPGs and then uh, and then Bethesda games. It looks like it was that was the most popular. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Well, hold on. There's there's a, there's a few layers to this. Uh, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> You don't, you don't know what you just awoke, chat. You, you have no idea. We're, we're going to start with this one. My this head's crippled. This isn't the hottest of takes, but maybe over time we'll get to the even spicier oh, ones. Oh, boy. Uh, Dungeons & Dragons has ruined tabletop RPGs Ooh, for the next decade. Starting out with a very strong statement there. Okay, go on, David. Uh, okay, so uh, this is partially... I'm going to pre preface this. I love Critical Role. Okay. They have ruined the expectation of RPGs <laughs> for the next 10 Christ. years. Here's the thing. Dungeons & Dragons does this thing where it has separated a lot of the rules and a lot of the variants into three core books, right? You've got the Monster Manual, you've got the Player's Handbook, that's fine. Then you mm -hmm. have the Dungeon Master's Guide. And what that separation does is it makes it appear as though the Dungeon Master is the arbiter of everything else and they need to know all the rules. That's the way you came in. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, they need to know all the rules, and they need to run the game, and they need to be the one running everything. That's the way where the ghoul is. Turn down this hallway. Okay, thank you. Sorry, I didn't want. I wanted to let you cook. I'm sorry. Um, and Matt Mercer, who is a wonderful DM, but he mm -hmm. has set up this expectation where everyone sees what he does and the world building that he has done when we get into Critical Role in the first campaign or mm -hmm. when we get into the second one where he has an established setting that people have built into. Uh, and and they everyone thinks that, like, oh, that's just Matt Mercer that did that. The group gives him a lot, but because uh, you don't recognize that immediately, uh, we've created a culture around tabletop RPGs where it feels as though the DM is in charge of everything. Uh, that is not the way it should be. Players need to be, uh, input as well, but a lot of people just expect them to be hand-fed a critical role story. No, that's, you're that's you're right not though. How things work. You're so. Do you want to? David's been um, a DM. So for those of you who. Um, this is actually a really good time to promo where on every other Saturday we actually play Pathfinder 2nd Edition here. David has been like 
our career DM, Dave and I actually met through Dungeons and Dragons specifically, Yama. right? Oh shit. Um, but David's been DM. How many years have you been DMing now, bro? Uh, nine. Yeah. So continue to speak your your truth, cause you're spitting facts. Also, uh, in, in, in a similar vein, uh, you're gonna run into the room with the pool again, by shit. the way. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Won't let me like I can't get him to be seen. Yeah, well he's invisible all the time. Oh, so it's not even worth it. Oh wait, what? You entered Vats anyway. Shit, how do I Well get me out! The other thing that we've done, fifth oh, okay. edition has normalized the Oh well I'll just home rule fix for it. Yeah. Find a system that works. No, I agree with that because the amount of people I've talked to that are like, here's my homebrew, this is so cool. I'm like, this is already a thing in Pathfinder. I have a friend who, starting his campaign, he had me look over his campaign primer. Mm -hmm. And it was an 80 page book that he made. And Bless his heart. 15 pages of it was world lore. And I'm like, okay, that's fine. Don't expect everyone to read this in one sitting, but that's, you know, I, I get it, it's cool. And then the other 50 pages were mechanical changes, new spells new combat maneuvers and new subsystems <clears throat> to make the game more engaging for players. Specifically, he was trying to make it fun for martial characters who don't have spells. Right. Um, and I'm like, dude, why did you make all of this? There are systems that have this baked in already and you're just trying to shoehorn it into 5th edition. <clears throat> to the point that he's not really playing 5th edition anymore. He's playing something loosely based on 5th edition. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that, that that's my big thing. And that's why, like, don't get me wrong, Pathfinder First Edition is a fantastic system, but also it does have player skill checks where you need to know that there are feats that are good and feats that are bad, and there's a whole, like, like the, there's the whole dipping into different classes. Thing. I don't want to have to roll the shit. I'm not a huge fan of that thing. It's cool if you are. Pathfinder Second Edition, I think, to I, me, I is, think is Pathfinder, the better system. Yeah, I would uh, say Pathfinder Second Edition is, like, the perfect balance, also, honestly. Also, since, since I'm on this, um... The new book, Tales from the Vault, first of all, some of that art was questionable. I think it was AI. Oh, I'm, I'm just going to say that straight up. Uh, but, but second of all, if you want to play a game that is about heists, I want to clarify. I'm not saying that you should not ever have a heist in your tabletop RPG game. Oh, I love crime. Have a heist. That's fine. But if your entire game is going to be heist consecutively strung together, Blades in the Dark exists. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and I was talking to um, Dee about this, another uh, tabletop RPG. What? Hey, 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 well, hold on. That's a rocket launcher. <laughs> That's not fair. That's cheating. What? What are you? Wait, okay, well, fine. If we're gonna, if we're gonna, if we're gonna play by those rules, then I'm getting out my fucking. Where is this shit? Give me this. All right, you're gonna. Oh, is it? No, you're right. I think it's an incinerator. Here, come here. This is gonna be a problem. Ha ha. Okay, come on. Yeah, that's what I thought. You've crippled both your arms. Well, not that time. Oh, fuck. Another one. He's still there. Well, go away! God damn it. Oh, it worked. It worked. <laughs> okay. This is, this is the last thing that I will wins. rant about. Oh, my God, your armor is fucked. Um, well, that's why I need the space suit. Yeah. I'm out of stimmies. You're going to need to use a doctor's bag. Ah! <laughs> you got hit by it. Uh, is that why I this, is, this is the last thing. Uh, Edge Runners. Cyberpunk Edge Runners comes out. Fantastic, wonderful show, by the way. If you haven't watched it, it made me cry. Uh, it, it's and David rarely show. cries. The amount of people that showed up afterwards on the D and D subreddit and were like, "I want to mod my game to be like Cyberpunk." <laughs> Cyberpunk it is, is an RPG. <laughs> it is though. You're right. And like the core rulebook is twenty dollars on Drive Through RPG. Buy it and play something else. Hmm. Like, like, not, you don't need to mod 5th edition to be everything. Yeah, And I'm gonna can... be honest with you, it's not that good at being the thing it's trying to be. No. <laughs> and the thing is, I feel like, and I was talking to Dee about this, so many people are trying to, like, so many people refuse to just try wait, wait, other wait. tabletop oh. RPGs. Hmm? Uh, while you are here, I don't want you to miss this, on that table somewhere, there's, my like, a food sanitizer thing? Mm. I think it's, is, I think it's that? That's a knife. No, that's a butter that. knife. That's a stealth, that's a stealth boy. boy. Am I right? Is this where the food sanitizer is, Chad? That's a cup. That's a cup. I thought it was on this table. That's a pitcher. That's a Brahmin steak. I think you might be wrong, Bucko. I'm sorry. Uh, I might be wrong. Yummy. So, but Snicks. yeah, that, that, this is this is my challenge to you if you're out there and you play fifth edition primarily. Okay. Mm, that's wow. fine. Enjoy it. 
I'm, yeah, that I doesn't mean you can't fun. enjoy 5th edition. But... We enjoyed 5th edition if, for, like, years. If you're ever getting a little tired of 5th edition or you're tired of homebrewing everything, if you're the DM or whatever, I challenge you to pick up Blades in the Dark. Pick up Banners in the Dark, which is a similar system. Pick up the Pathfinder 2nd Edition rulebook. Pick up any other RPG and just give it a shot. Do you want to make your hot take even hotter? How so? Do you want to talk about um, Paizo versus Wizards of the Coast? I I'm telling I, we got we got a lot of people have subbed tonight. If they want the spicy, I want you to give them the spicy. And thank you for all your support. Um, but now I will whore out my boyfriend to give spicy hot takes. Oh, my God. Uh, okay, so uh, you mean, like, as a company? Well, also, I think it's worth noting that Paizo has all their shit out for free. Yeah, okay, so Paizo's From rules, an ethical standpoint. Paizo's rules are all out, out there for free also, which, by the way, I, I know I just said buy the book. Obviously, support the creators. Please do. Yes. The rules are online for free supported by Paizo. Yeah. Archives of Nethys has mm -hmm. every rule, every monster stat block, every spell, every attack, every weapon, everything that's been officially published is out there for free. Yeah. Uh, meanwhile, if I try to look up something for 5th for edition, I am either on a third-party website that has scanned the handbook, or I need to pay for D&D Beyond. Yeah. That, I feel like the thing with D&D Beyond is like a whole other thing, honestly. Okay, hold on, you're going in circles again. Food! Turn, turn right. Wait, no, I don't... Oh, that's where we yeah, came from. Right. Okay, I see. Oh, they got, they removed it? Oh, uh, okay. Left. Here? Go down here. Okay. This is where the jail was. Oh. Where the jailer was, but you haven't looked through the cells because you got chased out. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. Also, if you if you want to play Star uh, their um, spell jammer, play Starfinder instead. If, yeah. if you're trying to play it with the fifth edition rules, it, it, they try to cram everything into a hundred pages. Play Starfinder instead. <laughs> um, but yeah, they're out there for free. Um, Paizo goes out of their way to hire writers that are from backgrounds relevant to the ones that they are emulating in yeah. the game. So, like, Tien Xia is, like, the new book coming out that is essentially uh, uh, and the Asian-Japanese kind of inspired, like, continent. The entire writer's room is, is all people that are of Asian descent. Yeah. Which is important. I, as it should be, you know? Yeah. Uh, same thing with the Mwangi Expanse. It was mostly yeah. people of African descent or people who have been affected by colonialism or, yeah. or that culture in some way. Well, and I get, like, the argument of, like, ooh, it's just fantasy. But, like, I hate to burst your bubble, but fiction affects reality. Yeah, fiction, <laughs> fiction affects reality and it and reflects, reflects it. what it comes from. Yeah. Uh, well, that's why I always, like, get into... I've gotten into so many arguments in my TikTok comments about um, the Civil War in Skyrim. And it's like, you can make the argument... I, I firmly believe that there is no good side in the Civil War in Skyrim. But if I were to pick the lesser of two evils, personally, I would probably pick the Empire. Because ugh, the, the Stormcloak rhetoric is like... I want, to talk about, I want to talk about what Boundary just said, by the way. Where the does Minecraft the Minecraft thing, stuff? The Minecraft thing made me so Wait, angry. Wait, what was the Minecraft thing? I haven't so, heard about so that. So they released uh, a small... It was free, okay? Okay. So keep in mind, it's free. Okay. That That's who you're looking for, I think, by the way. Oh. Um, Whoopsie. So yeah, she didn't make it. That's fucked up. Anyway. So you can go talk to Harlan now. Anyway, but, um, here's Wonderwall. They released a small... It was, like, part of the D&D &D movie because they made D&D &D Legos, right? Yeah. I like Which, Legos. side note, Hasbro, you're a fucking toy company. I don't know why you haven't been doing this forever. No, really, though. <laughs> I, well, back when I was, like, really into Magic the Gathering, I would have paid big money for, like, Magic Legos you, you, or even, go, like, go is it? Go into the room that you were in. Okay, it is go, this go room. In that, okay. yeah, I didn't know how to get out of here. The stairs are on the way. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Um... You're a toy company. Make funny Mind Flayer hats and stuffed animals I know. and Lego set. Like, there are so many opportunities. You could have printed money and you just never did. No. But um, so they, they did eventually do Lego sets and they released a little supplement that was like five monster stats. <laughs> Thank you, um, Lag Wolf. I love you. <laughs> I appreciate you. No, but um, yeah, no. So the the. They released a five monster supplement where it was Minecraft monsters in fifth edition. I'm not is, opposed to which that. Which is kind of cute. So it was like an Enderman and mm -hmm. like a, a dragon. 
They put the wolf in. It's the same wolf stat block <laughs> Jesus from Christ. the monster manual See? with a Minecraft wolf. And as someone who like genuinely really enjoys Minecraft, though, I don't stream Minecraft because I'm like, I, I frankly think I would be awful at actually streaming right. Minecraft, but I enjoy it a lot. I feel like there could have been a, some really cool opportunities to make yeah. Minecraft mods like or mobs like way more scary. Honestly, like that could have been a cool thing. Um, but I don't mind having cute monsters either. They could you have know? done something cool with it, but they literally just reprinted the wolf stat block. <laughs> Did they like draw them in a different art style no. or anything? Okay, that's lame as hell though. It, it was just the pixel art, like like Minecraft Wolf. Can you, that's and, so. And it had these same stats. That's as the lame. Wolf. I honestly, I had no idea that was a thing. I thought Boundary was like shit posted. No, it's a thing. It's a thing. <laughs> I downloaded it. I looked into it because I was really? curious, and then it was it, it's it's just the regular wolf. Here's the thing. At the end of the day. Did you find my friend? About that. I see. Well. Spare About me the details. Um, Damn it. I'm gonna miss that crooked yellow smile. All right. You did your part, so I'll do mine. Look around up here if you want. I'm gonna make a break for topside. All right, well, now so, we can uh, go through and look around here. Hold on, quick save. Okay. I'm pretty sure he has landmines in here. Oh, motherfucker. So, okay. Um, there are traps. Eyes on the ground. Keep an eye out. Wait, what? Why are you coming He's back? He's leaving. He's oh, okay. leaving. Bye! So now you can tell the Nightkin that he can come in here, but you might want to loot it yourself first for a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Uh, no mines, but there's traps. Oh, I see some bear traps. Oh, you don't okay. have a high enough repair skill. I'll just, just around uh, walk around the bear tra Oh, there's a few I forget. of them. Can someone okay. remind me, is there a skill check to disarm the grenade bouquets? I think there might be. Uh... Yeah, there's a, is it explosives or repair? I think it's explosives, right? Mm, yeah, yeah, okay. I feel like I'm gonna burp, but I don't wanna like burp in my mic, but like, I feel it coming on. Uh, shipment mistake. Uh, workplace so misbehavior. Is, oh, I wanna know the T. Uh, do you wanna read this or do you want me to just summarize it? Can you summarize it what, for me? So the government sent them a, uh, sent them uh, stealth boys by mm -hmm. accident which is why they're here. They're not supposed to be here. Uh, and then uh, the men in the company were using them to turn invisible and, like, sexually harass people. Uh, uh, and it ends in everyone needing to take HR training. <laughs> Jesus It's Christ. incredibly fucked up. That's fucked yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. While it is not explicitly stated in the employee handbook, unauthorized use of military hardware against fellow employees is grounds for immediate termination. Uh, yeah, uh, to give a thorough reading to Repcon's sexual harassment. Uh, well, yeah, it's, fuck. it's it's fucked up. I thought it and was gonna be silly. No, it's fucked up. That's um, just sad. And then they, How do they I get out of here? The power button. Oh, twink. And then they were going to send it back the day the bombs dropped. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Might be futuristic, but still the 1950s. Ah. Well, that, it's like 2077 when this happens. I thought you were something. gonna say 2007 for no, some reason. No, no. Can you imagine the bombs dropping to like in sync? Oh my god, that'd be no. nuts. So the difference is that this world never creates the microprocessor. Oh, okay. That's where we diverge. So no, I know what that is. <laughs> instead of going to the um, to microcomputing and like the path that we go down, they focus more on nuclear technology. Okay. And hey, there's bullets on the ground Wee. there, by the way. Huh? Oh, okay. Let me go back. Wee. Okay. Anyway, uh, did, 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 have I ranted enough about tabletop RPGs? Yeah, was that take by? spicy no. enough, chat? Are we happy with the spicy take? Because well, I, I thought that was pretty good. I thought you got fairly spicy. To summarize, play something else. <laughs> Please. Michael ba Bay drops the bomb. Can you imagine? <laughs> and you like hear like the air, like the air signs, like the brr, brr, and then ooh, ooh, ooh. I like, to, like bro. I want to listen to what's the word? Okay, here's my question for chat now. What is the worst song to be listening to when the nukes fall? What like what's like the worst option where you're like this just this is just too much you know also where the fuck am I going? You can you can go talk to the super mutant again. Okay. Despacito, <laughs> poop noodle. I what about like I, I don't know I kind of like I, I kind of want to listen to Buddy Holly as my like my skin melts from my flesh. Honestly. Uh, you, you oh shit. Uh, this guy right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big boy. Big boy. Hi, big boy. Antler sings for stealth boys. 
Have you found them? Party in the USA? What if it was like a Nightcore song? Like every time we touch, but like the Nightcore version. I think Undertale Tem Shop would be pretty good. Tem awesome. Shop stuff! Last night can to have them. What about, um, oh my god. What if it was like the Naruto opening? <laughs> what happened there, though? I wasn't paying attention. Talk to him. I thought I talked to him. Antler Singh. Okay, I haven't oh, found sorry. the self you, you yet. Need to, you need to find them. They're in that room. Uh, They're in the room that, uh, that you were just in. God damn it. You need, okay. to, you need to find the ship and manifest. Oh, it's the manifest I need to find. I yeah, thought I was, like, looking for, like, that. a pile. Two weird sandstorm. Uh, the end of the world is we don't stop. What was, like, what's the other one I'm thinking of? What if it was, like, we didn't start the fire? <laughs> okay, what's worse, the original or the, the, the Fallout Fallout version? Boy, what? I, I what mean, you, you just, you just entered the room and you left. Wait, you wait, wait, no, I'm looking at the compass. No, I go in it's, and... It's just leading you to the room. Okay. You need to find it in the room on your own. God, I hate finding sh I don't want to use my brain. I want it all laid out for me. I don't just, like critical thought. You just walk into the room. Here comes the sun step. Okay. Uh, yellow submarine by the Beatles would also be fucked up. <laughs> Any Christmas carol also. Submarine. Yeah, there's a shotgun what? there. What? Um, well, give me... Lucky it missed. Oh. What if it was like... <laughs> You're doing great. What was that? that was oh, a grenade bouquet. Grenade bu bouquet? Yes. Why, why didn't you get me that for my birthday? You don't. I want. Do you grenade. realize how accident prone you are? What do you mean? Hey, there's a there's a medic box back there, by the way. Oh, where? Back here? No, you were looking right at it. Back here? Right there. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do it on purpose, but it was funny. Well, now there's not a mine there. Wait, wait! Oh, God damn it! I have to do all this again! Okay, You well. didn't really accomplish anything. You ran in circles for a minute. Thank you for the clip. I appreciate it, but God damn it! I need some Dr. Pepper after that one. And I'm all out of pickles. This is fucked up. Okay, let's let's try that again. I'm watching my steps. I'm watching my steps. I don't want to set the world on hey, fire. Okay. Hold down tab. Hold down tab. Oh. Now you have a little light too. Wait, whoa, 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 why didn't you tell me about that at the beginning? Now you never asked. <laughs> the humans are dead. What if it was like, I don't know. I want, oh. Do I like shoot these from afar and they uh, go away? Maybe. I think you missed. I think you missed again. Okay, that's okay. I think you're good. What if I just do a little hop skip? Uh, maybe. Oh, I can disarm them? I thought my skill wasn't big enough. No. No, okay. it's not. And you don't have um, the repair, so you just jump over the bear trap. Whee! I said the bear trap. Well, it worked out. No. So. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, that's just Four. mean. Okay, I'm just gonna. <laughs> Shimmy. If you're beeping, back up. Okay. No beeping. Okay, we're ever to jump over him again. Okay. Jump. Okay. <sighs> Patrolling the boat <laughs> really go makes you wish for a nuclear right, well, you, window. You know, I go up the stairs. These ones? Yes, those stairs. Okay, and watch it. Is there any more shit? I think up here is safe. That's a tank can. That's red roach meat. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Uh, uh, I think you want to go to the desk to the right. The desk to the right. Okay, this one. Okay. I don't know. I want to listen to light. Okay, open the terminal. Read the last entry. Oh, this one. Okay. We are sending back two crates of devices labeled stealth boys. Okay, sorry about that. So that that now you know where they are now. Now I know. I forgot. Okay, you need to I didn't. I, I don't like to read. So, I know. You know. Yeah. I don't know. I don't want to listen to like um you know that one like horny Vocaloid song where they're all moaning in the beginning. I think that'd be funny as fuck yeah. to die to. Party rock anthem. Be Party fun. rock anthem. Oh, thank you for the like come freak. Have fun making your foods. I hope they're yummy. Um. Making sure I'm not gonna get nanied. I don't want that. Street Fighter? <laughs> well, it's like you hear is a wop. Certified feek. Seven days a week. Wet ass. <laughs> you know? Hi!
Antler sings for stealth boys. Have you found them? Uh, what? But I read! No, they sent it back. Oh, okay, they were sent here by mistake, then sent back. But invoice note said stealth boys were here. Why can't that note be true? I, 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 I don't know. But human could be lying. He's stealing the stealth boys for itself. Oh, Antler, you trust so easy. Is he gonna fight me? Your lucky day, human. No, Antler, Antler believe you. Nikon will follow the new note Antler's to find the stealth goat. boys. No, Antler's Better a be there. Oh. <laughs> Shut up, David. <laughs> I don't know. I will say, uh, one... Don't... No, you need to go back upstairs and talk to Jason. Oh, okay. No. Uh, no, but um, I will say one game that, and, and I want to Excuse clarify, me. the gameplay of this game is not good. Don't buy it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Stop, you're on the wrong way. Yeah, it's all, way. It all looks the I same know, to me, I know, genuinely. I know it does, which is why I keep stopping you instead Thank of you. Thank you. Look at the precious. Um, Dead Island 2. Okay. <laughs> I love the original Dead Island. Dead Island 2 disappointed me. But mm -hmm. the setting where it's LA and it's full of like influencers and movie stars oh in the god. apocalypse and some of them are like oh my god my mansion and others are like this is gonna be great you're going the wrong way fuck up those stairs uh and and there are others that are just like good content this is gonna be great content everyone's gonna love this that shit. would have been me it's hysterical that absolutely would have been me i do like the setting we're uh, we're listing off songs because we were like what's like the worst song to hear when the bombs drop <laughs> But that has a very fun aesthetic of apocalypse, but we're having fun with it. I don't, would you make, would we make content during the apocalypse, David? Probably not. Well, if you're a coward, then I, just I just, say I'm so. going to be realistic about it. I mean, I probably would just be, well, we wouldn't have internet. We wouldn't have internet. We wouldn't have data or anything like that. For them, the, the apocalypse is still stuck in LA, so. Oh, Okay. Live tweeting the apocalypse. Live tweeting my mom getting her face was, ripped off by a skinwalker. Listen, Hashtag cute. Hashtag. By the way, Dead Island 2, it's not actually a bad game, but compared to the first one, it didn't live up to what I wanted it to Can be. you imagine, like, if we had a zombie apocalypse and then, like, we caught into, like, almost like this type scenario, but with zombies yeah, and Jason. shit? Oh, there's Jason. Um, and then we had influencers come back. Bro, the skincare industry after a Isn't zombie apocalypse... Clear? Booming. Oh okay. God. Um, the demons are gone. Praise the Look creator. Look at him for streams. And bless you, wanderer. New Vegas and the, the Mojave technically clear. never got bombed. I will lead my okay, flock so the basement. What's Vegas the Vegas itself the never got bombed, site. but the bombs I hope blew you will up over Vegas, there, so there was still massive there amounts of much to be done. Right. So it's still not a great situation to be in. It's <laughs> still not ideal. All right, well, let's follow Jason and see what but the we'll, tea is. We'll, we'll get into the details of that when you when you find a certain Mr. Somebody. I don't want to... Ooh, that. Mr. Somebody. Mr. Somebody. You love to... He, he goes... He, oh, he went, oh. They're going into the basement. Hey, why did that one guy get a space... Oh, what, what's... Which one is the imposter? <laughs> <laughs> what, what's going on? Hey, why don't I... Hey, I want... A pink, big man Pinkish wants his space suit. You can pick yours up in the basement. I, I want my space suit. They look so stupid. I'm sorry. They look dumb as hell. <gasps> Holy shit. Yeah, that's right. Don't come at me trying uh, thinking that you can out-nerd me. <laughs> David is professional gamer, man. Literally. We just can't elaborate why. Basement. Basement. <gasps> space boot. Space, space boot. Baby, baby, booby, 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 yeah, which, by the way, these hot takes are dangerous for me because if I ever apply to be a designer <laughs> in some places, they're like, is this you as I'm spouting, is this you? As I'm spouting <laughs> bullshit about how 5e is bad? Well, I mean, like, just don't apply to Wizards of the Coast. Oh, I wouldn't either. They treat their employees like shit. Yeah, so, so I... Dave works for a a company. We're just not allowed to say what company it is. But he works in. Well, I'll let you. I'm not gonna fuck. What can you say? Uh, or what would I you can't like say to say? My title to say? because it's hyper specific, uh, and it would give away where I work. Mm -hmm. um, all that all that needs to be known is that I work in the QA department of a of, of a professional game development studio. Yeah, um, professional gamer man, and I'm like professional gamer. Not man. It's true. Yeah. But for me to say where I work, I need to take a whole HR yeah, course, you have to... like PR course about talking to people and representing the company. So. <laughs> you could have just ended it like, I need to take a PR course about talking to people. Like, yeah, I'm... <laughs> me too, bud. <laughs> uh, where's We're my spacesuit? You... Where's the spacesuit? Maybe they're near the window that follows the rockets. To the window. To the wall. <laughs> then name every video game ever made. <laughs> okay, um... Pong. 
Okay. Um, Mario. Barbie horse adventure. Etc. 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 Hello Fighter Kitty 6. Island adventure. Uh, that's all. Mm -hmm. That's every video game. Yep. That that's every every all oh, perfect. I want to be like the cool kids. <laughs> Damn, she's good. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just. I think. It, it, can you open the menu and mouse over this again? What's this? Yeah, it's it's also it's a radiation suit. Oh, so I can drink all the toilet water. All right, hey, bud. I waited to speak with you one last time before Maybe I get on their own clothes because it's broken. Man. I want you to know that we will remember for all eternity how you delivered us to the threshold of the great journey. Comes Our back preparations are nearly suit. complete. <laughs> But the rockets that will what carry us to salvation Wait, the antenna are yet wiggles? missing I vital see the components. Wiggles. If you would still help us, Wanderer, speak to Chris. He can tell you what is missing. There's there is something no way really that funny to me that enough, he's Wanderer. like calling Your himself a prophet, a like a holy being, and we his will name is like. You always. His name is Jason. I mean, to be fair, when Jesus was the prophet, there were a whole lot of Jesuses. Can you imagine? Like, I don't want to get like too like religious, biblical, but like. Can you imagine, like, being, like, Jesus, but you're not, like, the Jesus? Like, that would be so annoying. I mean, like... That's like being named, like, Rihanna. To you be, know? To be fair, this game is religious and political. Well, yeah, it's a but, like... To divorce it I don't, don't want to accidentally say something offensive, because no, I don't no, think I before it. I speak. But, like, can you imagine, like, also being named Jesus and also being a carpenter? And they're all... Like, it's called Life of Brian? Wait, really? Oh, my God. Because, like... You imagine, you're like, oh my god, it's Jesus, oh my god. I was like, no, this other guy, sorry. No, like, I'm, I would, I'd be so sad. I, I'm Jesus of Alexandria, you're looking for Jesus of Nazareth. Like, it, it's different Jesus. Rookie mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I hereby wish to nominate Evie the Jesus of Grimly Beat the Universe. There's a small, pro well, uh, no, I could be Jesus, I'm Jewish. You're not Middle Eastern? Well, no, but like, of VTubers. I, I guess. So like... I mean, if, if it's a VTubers, is being Jewish even? Well, no, there is an actual. No, there is a Jesus VTuber though. What the fuck? You haven't seen the Jesus VTuber? Why? Why? Why not? There, no, I mean, hold on. Isn't that like directly against Christianity doctrine though? I have no idea. To Im me... impose being the savior upon oneself—that sounds like not a thing they would do. There is anyway. A... No, I'm gonna hold on. I want to show this on stream. I'll show it to David. If you Was just... it RN Jesus? Yeah, it's VTuber Jesus. This doesn't seem right. It's VTuber <laughs> Jesus. I mean, people love him, so, you know. Okay, go on, Anime Jesus, I guess. Pop, live your truth, Anime Jesus. Live your shit. <laughs> Maybe after a character and actor, so I had kids referring to me as uh, the game and all. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, what is the far beyond? I have glimpsed it only in visions, Wanderer, but what I have seen Just a bit of is casual blasphemy. Miraculous. It is a That's place key. of light and healing. And There's I know no in my light soul in space. That my flock will be safe there. I, I mean, as long as they aren't legitimately claiming to be Christ, I don't think they are. I, I think it's a bit. Yeah, no, I, I, I'm pretty sure it's a joke, but I'm just like, this is. What's the tea cool with work. Chris? After all that you have done for us, I suppose you deserve to know everything. Oh. When Chris came to us. We tried to convince him that he was human, but this only angered him. Oh my god, he's literally he Delulu. Lost. They're just uh, using the rocket to go someplace far away. Days, oh, okay. Over the course of I'm which not gonna we go to Disney World. Can I just say far that every day I feel like I'm getting older because I saw it became clear that the creator had sent him to us to ensure the success of the great journey. Equally clear was that Chris should labor in blessed ignorance like of his humanity make up slang now, and his inability to make the journey himself. I still need to lower the game volume. Is... Hold up. Like, he's like loud as fuck. Hold up. He's got a weird reverb thing on his voice too, yeah. if I remember right. There we go. It's no coincidence that two humans have been vital to the success Somehow, of the even though we're like only like nine months apart, you're like ten you years older than me. Like mentally. To the sins of your kind yeah, sometimes I feel mine. like a fucking boomer. <laughs> you're redeemers both. Uh, uh, blast me to call yourself Jesus or something. I mean, maybe in Catholicism, they make up their own rules. That's true. Like, that's the thing is, I feel like it's like, they didn't have trademarks back then. Like, what's he going to do? Copyright claim you? I mean, you Catholicism know? has all the saints and everything, so I guess it's not that. Yeah. Different. 
I feel like self-proclaimed. Whatever. I'm not gonna get into the religion. Right now. <laughs> I, uh, this could very quickly veer this, into this being can devolve. We're not gonna, we're gonna <laughs> All I'm going to say, Catholicism, <laughs> I respect it, but it does confuse the shit out of me. I will be honest. So if you understand Catholicism, good on you, because I don't know what the fuck's going on. I've tried. I don't understand. Okay. The Pope's got a fun hat, though. The Pope does get a cool hat, and he gets points for that. I, also I don't know. Can funny. you imagine, though, like, to be the Pope? Okay, this is my last thing about the religious thing. Because to be the Pope... Right? I saw this TikTok about it, and it was like, you have to go through all this school, all this training, all this stuff, and then you have to be picked to be the Pope. Yeah. Right? What if you do all that shit, and then you don't get picked to be the Pope? I mean, you still get to be, like, a, a bishop or a cardinal. That's well, yeah, not... but that's not the same. Yeah, do you know how they tell if the Pope is dead? How? They find him on his bed, and they tap him on the head with a golden hammer. And they're supposed to, Wait, like, really? Yeah, they're supposed to yell, so they're like, Pope Francis! But what, that, but they bash his head in to see if no, he's they're dead? Like, they're like, oh, well, that's how they're gonna, oh, that's it. Oh. So that's how, oh, oh. Okay, I feel I like. I always thought, what if someone just spray paints a claw hammer gold and is like, Pope Francis, bang! No, that's what I'm saying, is like, they, they, they could easily be like a coup to, to become Pope. You I'm know? pretty sure everyone else in presence would notice as you splatter the Pope's skull. Well, what if they're all in on it? Theoretically, I think they're allowed to bash his head in. That's you gotta make, up. you gotta make extra sure. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, I need to stop. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna I'm, say something stupid. I'm gonna get us in trouble. We're, it's we're, fine. David, we're. Okay. Anyway, what is the Great Journey? We wish to escape the barbarity of the wasteland. Darth Talon and Darth Maul would have been a thing. Like in a homosexual way. The like they're gonna kiss. To my flock, a new land. A place of safety and healing. Like, they would have been... No, they would have existed, the I think, is the idea. Uh, I remember Disney a lot of Star Wars I think Darth when Maul should here. get to kiss boys. He probably has. Good for him. Good for him. Uh, are you seriously going to make your great journey on those rockets? Yes. The rockets will convey us to our promised I'll land. I'm going to sneeze. Sneeze your yay. Vision upon vision. I am gay. <laughs> but now I can't sneeze. <laughs> Why would you say that? Now I can't love women. That's part of my brand, David. Me loving women pays our bills, David. I've single-handedly undermined Evie's brand. No! <laughs> uh, the rockets will convey you and your flock straight into the ground. Oh, that's not very nice. Uh, so you're going to leave Chris behind? Yeah, they really said, fuck you, Chris. Yeah. Such is the creator's will. <laughs> The creator's will says you're lame. God says fuck you. The creator's will says no boys allowed. The radioactivity of the far beyond is much stronger. I mean like funny that they think space is radioactive. Yeah, they Mm. Uh It's none of my business. I'm not getting involved. Chris of shall be declared the saint yes, of the that great the journey atmosphere filters before the radiation from the sun. I hope the sun is technically radioactive. Sadness. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. <laughs> uh, do I want to be mean? I mean, you. do you think this is going to work? No, but, like, he seems real excited. I don't want to rain on his parade. I think you should. But rain raining on, well, uh, no offense, but I think you'll die. I understand your concerns, friend, and I thank you for voicing them. But the Creator's will for us has been made he manifest. He really just hit you with the, uh, but Jesus told me to. Okay, bud. There is no way that we can You get on you your rocket, you on. drink your Kool-Aid. I'm not, I'm not part of it. Well, no, you need to help. We will remember you ah, always. Shit. I like your funny words, Magic Man. Um, yeah, he really, oh, oh, hey, bud. Yeah, talk to him. He knows God, imagine yeah. being the weird one in a group full of ghouls. That's almost impressive. Jason yeah. says that I yeah. am to cooperate with you on the final tasks necessary to launch the Great Journey. Does he know he's not invited? No. Oh, I kind of feel bad for him. I think he can tell him. But he also has a really punchable face. He does really. Have it. I think it's the mustache. Yeah, I don't... Something about it. Um... Cool, Jesus says it's okay. Uh, so the Great Journey will use these rockets... Obviously, He's really it's mean. taken months, but, he is. but I've nearly got them in working order. Soon they'll take us to the far beyond. So about that, I was us. skeptical <laughs> at first, of course, being a man of science. But Jason is certain, and I believe in Jason. Jason does not believe in you, baby boy. I'm. How can I help? <laughs> I'm gonna help. 
I was close to completing work on the rockets before we were driven into hiding on the top floor. Two components were missing. A quantity of isotope 239 igniting well, yeah, agent isotope 239 and a set of thrust, thrust control, control modules. modules right? You're my the thrust igniting control agent module. is highly uh, radioactive and decays quickly. Uh, yeah. That's why we can't use the drums that leak down on the launch that? pad. It's no, no longer potent okay. enough. I need you to find an intact, shielded container of the igniting <laughs> Thanks, bud. As for the thrust control modules, Those, they were custom she built she for these my rockets. Leg. They won't even launch without them. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I'll track those down, I guess. Very well. We don't need a huge amount. Two to three liters should be enough. <laughs> uh, what do you do here, even? I'm the Flox resident engineer. You the Jesus of Bethesda games? I'd accept machines. being, like, Jason Skyrim Jesus. But the thing is, is, like, without me. I guess my thing is, course, like, I haven't actually played a have lot of Bethesda materials. games outside that's of Skyrim. And that's part of why I wanted to do this, because I know that a lot of the people that watch me like a, just Bethesda games in general. So, like, I probably will play, um, oh my Starfield. god. Yeah, I probably will play Starfield. I'm probably going to play Fallout 4. And ev eventually I want to go back to Oblivion. I've tried streaming Oblivion before. Uh, but it didn't end very you, well. You specifically did the thing we told you not to do and then ate shit. <laughs> do you, so, back when I streamed Oblivion, this was like two years ago. Um, you, hold on, do you want to... Here, let me get out of this. Him? Yeah, okay. Um, you you want to ask him for a tip on how to find the isotope? No. I want to cause problems. Why don't they let you work down on the launch pad? Hi, man. When I joined the flock, Jason made it clear that he wanted me to supervise the repairs. Not do them myself. Oh, Jesus. It would be a waste of my gifts to work on just one system at a time. From up here, I've been able to supervise the entire project. Okay. Um. Oh, jeez. Do we want to break his delusion? I, I don't know if you're going to be able to break. I mean, you can try. I'll give it a try. Uh, don't know how to tell you this, bestie, but your entire life is a lie. I thought we were past all that smooth skin. But you just can't resist oh, the Jesus chance Christ. to mess with me. You're a typical, typical human. human. I just... I I'm not like other humans. <laughs> grew up in I'm different. Four, he, grew up, he was a human once. Nice upbringing like. if you like assault rifles and target practice. But oh, you prefer machines that don't shoot people? <laughs> not so You'll nice You'll die then. from solar radiation. Just so you know. maintain the vault's reactor? Hauser? <sighs> Mitchell? No. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Make it Haversome. He likes machines. Haversome won't mind getting irradiated. Haversome won't mind mutating. Oh my god. He's already ugly as it they is. They think they're just... Oh my god. Haversome they think they're just bullying him. his hair starts falling out after a few years. There's no oh connection, god. Haversome. You're neurotic. Yeah, I'm not like other humans. I play with tumbleweeds and drink toilet water. Um... Wait, you left your vault because you were going bald? Bald? Oh, that's right. You call this bald, <laughs> smooth skin? I'm a monster. Yeah. A monster. Gonna slap your bald head and watch it vibrate. Boing. Um. I, I didn't realize this before for anyone who's played this. He he was a boomer. All right. What Wait, you what? There's doing? a faction called the Boomers. Oh. <laughs> you'll, get them, you'll get to them later. I didn't make that connection until just now and I've been playing this Wait, game forever. Wait, he thinks he's a ghoul because of male pattern <laughs> And because he got bullied for not liking rocket launchers enough. Oh my god. Um, <laughs> there's so much to unpack with this man. He's got issues. Uh, I'll go looking for your shit. Hurry back. Never have we been so close. Yeah, Boomer okay, means but... something different. I don't want to yeah. spoil it, but just know that there is a faction called the Boomer. Okay. But no one explained to her what it's like. By the way, you, you need to stop. Uh -huh. You need to leave the facility altogether. There's that ladder. Oh, okay. I was, arrow went that way, so yeah, I was going I know, that way. I know, but it, the, the ladder is, is, is much easier. Okay. It'll get you directly outside. Okay. All right, here so we go. So remember where this is, because this is going to be easier when you want to get back in there than going through Hatch. the entire facility again. Hatch. Yeah. Okay. But, okay. like, like walk out to the road and see how it connects. Yeah. To the road. Okay. Which, side note, notice how over this there is a bunch of radioactive sludge. <laughs> also, okay. hold on, walk out there a little bit. Mm, to the sludge? Yeah, towards the sludge. Sludge time. Is this... Run, run over, like, towards there. Yeah. 
Okay, yeah, run up, run up the other side. Is this where, isn't there a uh, missing Brotherhood patrol around here somewhere? I, I don't know, bro. Chat, maybe I'm thinking of the wrong thing. All right, all right, I don't it, know, it, bro. It, it's fine. Uh, so you need to find Isotope uh, 219. I don't even know what an Isotope is. Uh, uh, someone who's smarter than I am could probably explain. Chat, does anyone place. here know what an Isotope is? You want to check your map to see where it's pointing you? Where is it pointing me? Tab. Oh, fuck. There's I keep no pressing M. I, yeah, I know. Uh, data. Data, that's right. Map. World map. World map. We're going over this Somewhere way. to the east of Novak. Oh, I can just do this. There we go. Okay, radioactive oh, rock. Wait, is this radioactive? This is this is uh, the home of radioactive. Wait, activity. there's gonna be geckos. Geckos? It's an element with a different number of covalent electrons. Ooh. Oh yeah, that it would normally. Yes. Okay, I, I do remember learning about that. Okay, interesting. So, but um, anyway, going by what we were saying earlier about Oblivion, the re the last time I played Oblivion, this was a few years ago, um, when David and I were involved in a. <laughs> In a polyamorous relationship with one of the contributors of the Oblivion Wiki. Yeah, they contributed to the bad one. <laughs> is that why? Is that why we broke up with him? Yes. <laughs> listen, that's listen. not actually why, but uh, I think that's a, I think that's actually a better answer. I like to say it's the reason. But the, the unofficial Elder Scrolls pages is so much better than the fandom wiki. It's not even funny. You might want to quick quick save. Okay, but the thing is, is go, David go had like so I was playing it by myself. David had briefed me on what to do. Uh, Ex-boyfriend had briefed me on what to do. I had, like, notes given on what to do. And I still fucked it up. So if we play Oblivion or Morrowind, David's gonna be right here <laughs> the whole time because... I don't think... Oh, boy. Thing. I think Morrowind is a fun game and I think everyone should play it. It's Mr. Radical. <laughs> Mr. Radical. You might want the radiation suit. Okay. Um... Yeah, there he is. He's Mr. Radical. Oh, he's kind of hot. Well, he's dead. Oh, okay. Uh, but, um, I don't think, I, I'm not sure, like, I think everyone should play Morrowind. I think it's worth playing. <laughs> uh, it, it's not for everyone, uh, and it's also very slow, and I'm not sure it would be entertaining. How do you mess up playing a video game? Oh, <laughs> oh, honey. <laughs> well, you see, because Oblivion... Do you remember what I even did? Okay, so Oblivion has the <laughs> attribute side. system. Yeah. And in typical Bethesda fashion, it's not in any of the games following Oblivion because it's broken, and instead of fixing it, they just got rid of it. Yep. Um, pretty much the issue that you run into is... So you know how Skyrim has, like, the, the world levels up alongside you? Mm-hmm. Well, in Oblivion, um, it pushes... It levels up beside you. But you need to level up certain skills to level up certain attributes. You don't just put points in it. You need to level up the skills to level up the attributes. Um, meaning that if you don't level up very carefully and on purpose for a, a specific way, like if you don't specifically grind out five strength a level or whatever, you very quickly become worthless. Uh, uh, the world I was worthless! The world outscales you very quickly. I was and outscaled. You did, you did too much fucking around. <laughs> Um, I literally fucked around and found well, out you did too very much fast. Fucking around and you leveled up very poorly. That by the time you made it to the Oblivion Gate in Kavach, it had knocked it up to the next tier of Daedra, and you were getting your ass kicked. Yeah, it was um, it was not good. Um, so when I did that, I had been playing all by myself. Essentially, no one was like sitting with me while I played it. Um, so. If we play Oblivion, which again, I'm not opposed to playing Oblivion again and giving it another try. Because again, I like playing Bethesda games. I enjoy them a lot. And the reason I play so much Skyrim is Skyrim was my first Bethesda game. And I've hyper fixated on it since I was like 12, right? That's why I'm able to play Skyrim twice a week, every week, you know, because I genuinely love the game, you know, and I know a lot about it. Um, but the thing is with me, is I don't want to go out of my comfort zone when it comes to games a lot. A lot of times I think the reason I play Skyrim so much is I'm like, I know I like this game. I know things about it. I am only going to play this game, right? But this kind of forces me out of my comfort zone in a way. Um, but I'm also a little dense, and that's why David's here. There, there's also the notice how much time found the components has been spent we in this game that is similar to Skyrim, wandering in circles. Yeah, uh. yeah. All right, I have an entire container of the igniting agent. Yes, that's the stuff. 
I do want to try the Witcher. The container shielding too. must be I intact, listen, or you'd be dead by now. I played all three Witcher games. Now all I need is the yeah. thrust control modules. <laughs> Don't play them. Okay. Third one's great though. Bye. Third one is probably top ten games of all time. The first two are not good. Not great. That's the thing, though, is I know that you guys like Bethesda games and want to see me play different than Bethesda games, so I will play different Bethesda games, but I just don't expect me to be as knowledgeable about them as I am with Skyrim, because I have literally, only Bethesda games I have played is Elder Scrolls Online and Skyrim. That's literally it, but I just, I, I, I love Skyrim. I okay. love Skyrim so much. <laughs> I'm going to hit two comments in chat. Two isn't necessarily bad. I just don't like it. Uh, it's too linear. I don't think it's a David's good game. David's getting real spicy. The other thing, Thank though, you, is, is, is Kite Man, what you said, you need to... No, you need to not use what you specialize in to remain effective. You need to purposefully not use your main skills so you get more skill-ups, so you so when you level up, you get more attributes. You need to actively avoid using the things you want to use. Yeah, that that certainly... It, it's, it's very counterintuitive. A bit of a fucky-wucky, if you say so. I don't so know, do you it, think we should is, play this Morrowind? Is, uh, this is a dead end, by the way. Ah, oh, shit. It is incredibly counterproductive, so if you want to play a warrior, but you want to get your strength up all the way, and you want to use swords, uh, well, you better stop using that sword and start using a hammer. Mm. And then if you've leveled up too much, um, you don't want to waste the skill. You, you look at your map, honey. Okay. <laughs> you're going to want to stop using the hammer entirely because if you level up your strength too much in one level, then it's wasted. Oh, so you're going to need to switch to using a, uh, switch to using like spells entirely or a bow. <sighs> We're getting really spicy tonight. I didn't think our hot takes would be that spicy, but we've had like, so, like I'm like thinking about, I'm like, we've had some spicy hot takes tonight. <laughs> I have a lot of opinions. <laughs> like, I don't know if I, people were ready for the spice, but if you stuck around through the spice, thank you. I love you. I appreciate you. But also, it's, if, it's been spicy tonight. If you disagree with me, I respect your opinion. All right. <laughs> I don't know so, why, but I really thought David was gonna be like, boy, if you disagree no. with me, die. Like, <laughs> I respect your opinion. Everyone's entitled to enjoy games however they like. See, and I think yeah, Oblivion is fun, but it is jank. As it's definitely hell. not. Here, my problem was I went into it thinking it'd be like Skyrim, but with shittier graphics. I was very wrong. It's, oh my god. I was very incorrect. It is also, I, I, it, Puppy. it has, oh yeah, so, look up, no, no, don't go inside, don't go. Oh, the oh, puppy she, too! There's another puppy. Uh, oh, it, she's not on the stoop. Uh -huh. Puppy. He. <laughs> Alright, where is she? Where, where's, where's old lady Gibson? Maybe, Maybe she's she in is inside, card. yeah. Is she inside? Maybe. <gasps> the puppy three! Reyna. Oh, he's already puppies. Oh, four. she's asleep. Wake up! <laughs> the, way she just, the way she just. The way she just. Hi there, I'm Old Lady Gibson. Or oh, so you they sure are. Me. I've got odds and ends for sale, and I'm pretty good at fixing things too. You might have noticed the very large building just north of here. That's Helios One. The NCR runs the place, so it's off limits to prospectors. Mm. Do you have any thrust control modules from Repcon in stock? As it so happens, I do have some thrust modules, but they're expensive. 500 caps worth of expensive. Old Gibson is trying to get your hard-earned caps. Oh, wow, your barter and speech are bad. I don't uh, know how to talk to people. Um, do I just give them to her then? I mean, you could try one of the speech checks. I don't think it's going to work out. How do you know? Oh, you're charming in your own way, I suppose. <laughs> Not budging on the price for this part. Sometimes the failure dialogue oh is kind of fun. Oh my god. Uh, oh my god. Pleasure doing business with you. Thanks, old lady Gibson. All right, that was that was very nice of you. I okay. <laughs> Jester, I'm I'm, I'm going to I What are my skills? You put every level up skill point so far into gun. Uh, <laughs> which isn't necessarily a bad thing. But um, definitely makes you not the smoothest talker. But you do have 97 guns. 97 gun! Uh, but nothing else. And then here's my special for those who are so curious. So I didn't think about this when you made this. Uh, you don't have enough strength to use the bigger guns. Which is they're also heavy. why they're inaccurate. They're heavy. They are heavy. And I have little noodle arms. And that's okay. Uh, did you kill the old lady? No, I just... 
gave her money. You can't kill old lady Gibson. She's old lady she, Gibson. She, oh, that's the wrong. I fucking oh. just changed scenes on accident. <laughs> for, Stream's over. I, I guess. forgot I had hotkeys. Dead ass. Okay, there we go. Um, but um, yeah, I think my thing with like Skyrim is just like I, I've talked about this before, but I am unfortunately very busy <laughs> all of the time, and a lot of times until recently. Um, I have a problem with being a workaholic, um, so I've had to, like, carve out time for me to play games not on my computer, because I found that if I'm not streaming and I try to play games on my computer, I inevitably end up answering work emails or work DMs or stuff like that. Um, I really love being able to work with people around the world, and it's, like, a, the coolest job on the planet, honestly. However... If I, I'm the type of person where if I get a message, I feel like I have to respond to it right away or people will get angry at me, okay. right? So, like, when people DM me, they may think, like, in their time zone, it's, like, completely normal to DM me at that time. Whereas for me, it's, like, 10 o'clock at night and I'm about to go to bed. So, like, my thing is, like, my free time is so limited, I feel like sometimes I don't want to try different games because I'm afraid... I won't like them, and then I'll feel like I've wasted my time. But stream is kind of like a great opportunity for me to try new games, because even if I end up not liking the game, I still have fun because I'm hanging out with you guys. I'm, you know? I'm going to do a quick Eevee call out. Huh? Uh, sometimes you will sit down, and you'll be like, I'm going to relax and play a team fight Tactics. And I turn around, and you're playing team fight Tactics, but you're also editing a video and responding to messages and organizing events and composing between turns. And I'm like, yeah. Just play the damn game. Yeah, I'm I'm a bit of a workaholic, but I'm working on it. I found that um, I've started playing games on my Nintendo Switch a lot more because I found that if I get off my computer, it's easier for me to kind of like unplug, I guess, even though I'm like plugged into something else. Have you found the components we discussed? Yeah, I paid a pretty fucking penny for them. Indeed you did. And they seem to be in excellent nose. condition. Yeah. No, don't do that. Uh, well, the rockets are set to go, right? That's how you know yes. he's not a ghoul. He has I'll tell goals. Jason that the great <laughs> journey can begin. Yay, journey! We the band! Everything we need don't to stop rockets, Jason. Uh, oh, I mean, I'm down to play begin. Neko Para. Fuck it, you know? Hey. Uh, I want you to do something about it. Just lay on the couch, ignore any work you may be doing. It's Sunday, so I shouldn't be working on Sunday anyway. Yeah, so that's... Yeah. Until my stream. Well, I don't, because they're, like, streams not really work to me. Making, like, content for, like, TikTok and stuff, I enjoy it, but it is, like, work in a way. But, like, stream itself is, like, I'm just having a good time, you know? Let's say all day. <laughs> Am I allowed to go grocery shopping? Because when I go grocery shopping, David buys me a special treat afterwards. And that's important to me. <laughs> I want my treat. I wish there were subtitles for this section, because I I got hearing problems. I have no idea what the fuck he's saying. It's not really super important. Can I go in there? No. There's too much radiation, you'll die. But I have a radiation suit. It doesn't matter. There's no way to get in there. Chris, you have made this great journey. Which makes me wonder how. Well, okay. They, you this see the door they forward, use, it's just not a door you can open. Oh, uh, okay. Of the great journey. We shall never forget you. I ask that you forgive us, Chris, and give us your blessing. And we bestow ours upon you. What the fuck? Seekers, or the rockets, take your seats. The great journey awaits. To the promised land we go. To the far beyond. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> so he was just like, hey. You need to get up to the control room. You need to you need to send them off. Where's the control room? Uh, I think you need to go back into the actual building. How do I do that? Do I go out where I came? Uh, no, 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 no. Back up. up do I follow up the, the arrow? Top, the top. Oh, do you need to talk to him again? Do you okay, need to let's talk see. To... Is Chris going to have an emotion? Is he going to finally realize he's being Delulu? Did you hear him? My God, you are right. Oh, all yeah, along. no, that's right. <gasps> I'm no ghoul. Yeah, you're just, you're just bald. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, you're pathetic. <laughs> he kind of is. Do we want to be mean? Uh, that, that. Do you think old man Pingus would be that rude? I feel like he kind of would. Like in that, like you're pathetic. No wonder they're leaving you behind. You ain't nothing, Chris. You ain't shit, Chris. Leave me alone. Oh, God. Everyone else I does. feel bad. Leave me alone. Leave Chris alone. It's like 
back in. Leave Brittany alone. <laughs> um, well, that was kind of mean, but um, you know, maybe he needed to hear it. You know, just so he could. He's not being Delulu anymore, so at least there's that. Uh, yeah. I think he still thinks he's a ghoul. He's in den- He's like going through some stages of grief right now. You know what stage he's on? I, I can't tell. But there's. Th- I think there's only seven. I know. Where the stairs. fuck am I going? The okay. Stair. No, that's the way you came in. Wait, the where's the stairs? Oh, right, the stairs. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry. I I look at the co- I either don't acknowledge the compass or I take it way too literally. You are the that's only person, my problem. You're the only person I know who can get lost in a hallway. Thanks. It's not a compliment. Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> okay. Okay, if you Okay, there we go. All right, let's see what's popping. Turn right. Turn right. Go up the stairs. Up the stairs. Up the stairs. So I'm gonna be the one launching all the rockets and shit. Yeah. Oh well, that's nice. Okay. All right, come on up here. Bing bong bing. Oh, there's one of them. Yeah, it's the factory floor. They were making another one. Uh, okay. Oh, it's where we first met Jason. Yes. Okay, I see. I see where we're going. I think I know what's up. Okay, well, let's head over here. I don't want stairs, 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 stairs. I do want to say sometimes I feel mean being like stop, right, left, but like <laughs> I, I, I want to make it clear this is necessary for us to get anything done. I, yeah, I. That's why I'm not I like. I think, I think it's downstairs. Oh motherfucker! Okay. Not, not, like it's in this room or like this cell, but I. I don't oh down. Oh okay okay okay. I see I see. Over here. Here. Yeah outside. Oh test site okay. Oh, is this the button I need to press? Well, activate the navigation console. The console seems to have something to do with the course plot for the rockets, but you can't make heads or tails of how it works. Do you want me to tell you what you can use that for? What? If you have a science of 55 or higher, you can... Actually, no, wait, hold on. I'll let this play out first before I tell you. Launch button. I can't move. I know. It's, it's a cutscene. Oh my god, the music! <laughs> There they are! Yay! Oh, it's Flight of the Valkyries. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it I is. Oh, we're vibrating. Woohoo! What? Wait, did you see it? <laughs> Was okay. it supposed to do that? Yeah. So, if you have a science of 55 or higher, you can set them up to crash. Oh my god. <laughs> they or, crash or into each can, other. Or you can make it closer to the target. So you can either help them or you can just kill them all. <laughs> uh. Well, I'm liked. I, I did a good deed. Yeah, that's by Novak. Did you see the one, the one yeah, the rocket? One yeah, that's so funny. I love that. They, okay. They, 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 they figured it out. It's they, they got, they got back on track. Um, I'm sure they'll have a great time up there. I, I'm pretty sure they die. Like <laughs> immediately? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, probably. <laughs> well. Yeah, you know, this loading screen's taking fucking forever. I, I will say, karma doesn't matter as much in this game as it did in the previous games, but I do like the individual reputations. Yeah, well, that was so, something, one well, of the Skyrim mods I really liked, is the Skyrim reputation mod. They don't have that in base game Skyrim, and that's why I really enjoyed it. I have some I have some issues with the Skyrim reputation mod. Yeah. And like, it's it's a free mod, I'm not going to criticize it too much. Yeah. But there are some, like, like the way that it stigmatizes reading books. Wait, what? Yeah, you get you get a power modifier where people think you're more power hungry if you read too many books. That's stupid. God forbid <laughs> I want to be literate. Okay, it, yeah, that's dumb. It, it's the Nords. They're 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 <laughs> intimidated by your literacy. I know. Damn. You read books? What are you a cuck? Like? You read books? That's Daedra worship. <laughs> that's Daedra worship. Uh, what exactly does the reputation mod do? So basically, it makes it so certain actions you have. It's kind of like reputation in Fallout. Certain actions you have, you can have a good reputation in a hold or a bad reputation in a hold. So your choices and stuff do matter. But as David said, there are some things that no. uh, are a little dumb. I'm going to be matter. real. It, it doesn't make it matter. Um, it's not that impactful. It changes no. prices. It, yeah. It, it, it changes price you modifiers. You need discounts or you'll be charged higher for things, essentially. It, yeah. So if I read to too many Lusty Argonian maids, you're power hungry? Yes. yes. <laughs> um, I would like to point out, by the way, a lot of people don't know this. Um, the Lusty Argonian Maid Volume 2 in Morrowind is a spear skill book. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Um, 
Also, I feel like this loading screen has gone on for a bit too long. Um, give it a minute, but it is an interior cell, so I think the game might have crashed. Well, on that note, I hope you guys had fun today. We're, we're going to need to launch the rockets again next <laughs> we're time. We're going to need to launch fine. the rockets. That's fine. Um, well, I can do that off stream, but I think this is a good place to end it's anyway. Like, we <laughs> had, um, we were mean to a delusional man. We launched some rockets, and, um... I got crippled like six times, so you know. <laughs> is this gonna be the tradition as we stream until it crashes. Honestly, it's it's it usually crashes at like pretty good intervals, you know. So like maybe, you know. Uh thank you, New Vegas. Very cool. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's stream. I had a lot of fun. Um, I, f I still feel kind of bad for being mean to that man, but not that bad, I'll be honest. But if you enjoyed this, I'm so excited to see the memes. So speaking of the meme, I'm assuming Lag will posted it in the Discord. So we do have a Discord if you'd like to be notified for when I stream. If you're new in town, hi, my name is EB Games. I love women. My boyfriend Dave is on my head. Um... I stream on Twitch every uh, Wednesday, Saturday, and Sunday, and I stream on YouTube every Friday. All of those are at 6.30 p.m. EST. Um, I also have a VODs channel if you'd like to see um, the stuff that led up to this. I think the new command for it is YouTube. There it is. Yeah. Um, if you would like to see it, my VODs channel is actually my main channel now, so when I post my new cover, it'll be my first cover of the new main channel, and I'm kind of like, woo! Um, and then I also have a TikTok and Twitter if you'd like to follow me on other miscellaneous social media and stuff like that. I will say, if you are subscribed, um, next Tuesday, I haven't made the schedule for next week yet, but next Tuesday we are going to be having another sub hangout, a kind of hangout and learn thing. I'm going to be doing some commission work. I'm going to be doing some audio uh, work for uh, one of my students. And then I also, if we have time, I'm going to be continuing to record and work on my covers. So if you want to learn more about like audio mixing and... Um, watch me record a cover and see the process for that uh make sure your discord is connected to your twitch and you will be able to see all the sub channels if you sub tonight or got one of the gift subs or whatnot also so, if you yeah. join the discord you get more spicy takes from me david likes to talk lots of shit about things i talk so much and, shit. okay um i can't access discord actually i'm trying okay, to all right alt so what you're gonna okay. need to do <laughs> do i need to alt f4 no control shift escape okay control shift escape because i need to see who's live on twitch that open task manager, tab okay. in task manager. What a way to end stream. Uh, so it's... I just want to get my raid set up, please. Uh, okay. Alt, left arrow. All right, alt, left arrow. This one? Yeah. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, it was supposed to switch the the monitor. Okay. Here, uh, you're going to need to... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Alt, hit alt, tab again. Okay, alt, tab. I, I just need to know who's live. You're going to need to force shut down New Vegas. How do um, I do that? Well, here, I'm trying to direct you how to do it. Here, do you Can want me to get back to this? Do okay. You want to pass me <laughs> the I can't end the stream even if I wanted to. My mouse is like MIA. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we're uh, we're still here, chat. Mako's still live. We'll raid Mako then. Um, Can I type in the OBS? I I'm down to raid Mako. There we go. Okay, now we're cooking. Okay, For goodbye, New Vegas. Know, by the way, I opened Task Manager and then looking in the window of like <laughs> the preview for the Alt tab, I had to count how many spaces down New Vegas All was right. to close. We will raid uh, Miss Mako. She is one of my friends. Um, but let's see. She's been streaming for oh, a while. Shit, Holy a mac shit. And cheese ad. There's a mac and cheese mac ad on his stream. Uh, Mako is one of my besties, so we can make the raid message like fucked up. Um, do we want to do, <laughs> what's our fucking raid message going to be? Uh, nuclear waste raid. In, Yay. In, in the name of ghoul Jesus. Yay. That'll be our raid message. All right, gamers. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, a wonderful rest of your weekend, and I will see you tomorrow for Skyrim Sunday. Bye-bye.